This is my replacement for starting the stream music. I should find some music to put here when I'm starting the stream. Ba -do -ba -do. What am I doing? God. Okay. Uh, it's Alright, move on Twitter. Here we go. Story finale content. Hashtag VTubers. Hashtag VTuber EN. There we go. And lastly, we have Infinite Live because they have open lovely. All right, and that's all that done. Anyway, now I can probably kick things off. Let's get dragon. Well, let's bring this over to me. It's me. I realize that if I go to this, uh, I actually I can put it. Don't mind me. I'm just thinking about stream things. <laughs> that's blazing dragons dog nod. We're so close to done. Well, actually, no. There's a lot of post game. Um, in fact, it looks like what I want most out of this game is all in the post-game, but we're here for the finale of the main story. And my <sighs> beloved, in quotation marks, I really wish I could kill her. That'd be nice. Oh well. I bet at least get an achievement for it. That'd be nice. Alright. So I believe when we left off last time, yes, we're at max. We were desperately trying to get Alina to max on Sorcerer. That was like the goal of all of this that that's like the thing we're trying to do but i guess i can do my skills i mean there's no harm in that all right let's let's look at our sort of ending well we don't need this because we won't be using a long sword Ooh, that's a good one building knockdown and clear up greatly augment your strength i th i think that's what we want to spend on that's like the big one for getting to max Alright. That's that's sort of our reward. That'll be um So we uh may not be doing focus strikes anymore, so we can swap that out. Alright. We are changing vocation on me to Mystic Knight, our final vocation. The one that'll take us through to the end game and post game. All right, so our uh, best gear for Mystic Knight. 
Let's have a look. So there's Thousand Stings, which is pretty snazzy, and may be the best thing we have. The Thunder Kite Shield as well. Um, yeah, I think that's what we're using. There's the Silver Rapier, which is close, but not quite as good. Thousand Stings. Yeah, okay. Thousand Stings is the weapon. And the Thunder Kite Shield is the shield. Um, you haven't, like, got any of that shit, have you? No. Okay, good. Ahead. Um, so, we can actually use the Griffith Gear. That was a factor in things. Um, the Griffith Gear is still good. So we can bring that along. I believe that's still... Yes. Um, also, we need clothing. Which, I forget what the best clothing we had was. Was that dragon leather? Uh, probably. Yep, looks like it. Alright. Then we had the arms, which I believe were also Griffith was best. Yes. Um. We had the legs, which had the Griffith Greaves, and I believe those were the best. Yep. The cloak, which was the Paladin's Mantle. And our rings, which didn't matter too much, but we'll bring these along. Ring of Sir Ogre Bone. Okay. And that was our gear. Hey, Sayo, welcome. I'm just getting geared up for uh, a final boss, because, um, well, oh my god, it's shiny. Oh, would you, ooh, look at that, mm, that's a nice shine. Um, because there is, there is a little bit of preparation before the big dragon fight itself. Um, as we are just at the, uh... Sorry, brain fart. <laughs> we're, we're changing over to our final vocations. Um, so there's a, like the slightest bit of grinding to sort of like, yeah, this is it. This is, this is what we're going in and ending with. Um, and on that note, ah, this is the good stuff. Okay. So this is the special stuff. This is what I was switching over the Mystic Knight for. So I can do special blocks that actually give um magic damage that's pretty rad all right let's get let's get those going uh i won't go dark i, I haven't gone dark so far and it hasn't bit me in any way i'm not using a staff at all so we're just sticking with sword all right and i believe yes i also get the Sword attacks from a previous class, which is very useful. Um, leads into the air, and then... Yes. So we want that. We want to make sure to put these on. And since we don't need this... Um, we can actually go back. Unfortunately, this is a significant portion of Dragon's Dogma. So... But it is what it is when you're playing RPG, RPGs like I do. Alright, so we can swap that over to Fortitude and have a little bit extra defense. Hell yeah. And now this is us. That's pretty friggin' rad. I gotta be real with you. Oh, it actually like stays on our back. Huh. Oh, it stays on your back because if you're not using a shield, you might be using a staff instead. I I remember that. Right, okay. So. Let's check, because the, is the issue is, Alina here, as you can see by that rank, one dot away. Where I, wa I want to max her out. So she's ready for the final boss. And, uh, unfortunately, that means we're looking at quests. Um, uh, which I think the best one to do... What's something that we can run and do? 
real quick. Like, snakes, crows, come on. Some of this is gonna be... Sulfasaurians, West Grancis, and Bada Crags. I don't think I've been there yet. Saurians, deer, no. Alright, let's rest until morning. Because we don't actually want to be going out at night. Alright. And we're waiting for the server. That's what it is. <sighs> Alright, I, I know what we're going to do. We're going to teleport to the uh, Thieves' Den, and we're going to explore that southern shore. And by the time we're sort of done down there, that's when we'll be good. The, uh, Elena should level up down there. Alright, also I'm going to clear out my inventory, because I am way too heavy for this shit. I also don't need all that fiend luring incense. Or these. Uh, all that. All those. All that. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Let's go. Um, Eternal Fairy Stone, take me to... Fairy, uh, fairy Stone, Fairy Stone, take me to... to, to I, I can't think of a good rhyme. You know, you know if this was like a... Uh, a truly traditional fantasy that have a good rhyme to it. You know, we can actually see pretty far from here. Let's sit down and take a look. Hello. Yeah, I want to head that way. And just see what we find. Because something, I don't know, something feels like it's worth finding over there. Call it a hunch. We'll go along the beach. At least that'll be a, a bit of a different scenery, actually. Oh, that reminds me. I gotta... Ah, okay. So that's actually, like... Huh, cool. So I, I actually enchant my shield. That's pretty rad. Killing goblins, killing goblins, killing goblins. That's what we do. Uh, what do we do? Um, this is more of a... I, I guess it would be like a yes, Skyrim or Elder Scrolls sort of open world fantasy. It's a bit more linear than those. There aren't that many side quests. But um, yeah, this isn't uh, sort of mission based. The main thing you do that I would say defines this game is fighting giant monsters. Uh, this has Shadow of the Colossus style climbing over monsters. Uh, as well as that, you can knock them over, you can cast spells at them to stun them and have different effects. Um, so I guess it's uh, kind of Monster Hunter in that regard, actually. Um, so yeah, sort of Monster Hunter, Skyrim, uh, Elden Ring kind of thing. Uh, I think Elden Ring might be the closest comparison, actually. I've said it. Uh, before on the streams. There we go! That's what we were waiting for. The vocation rank is maxed. Well, okay, well, I mean, while we're here, I want to have a little bit of a look. But yeah, um, if we can find a big monster, I'll be able to show you sort of the main thing. Uh, but other than that, it's just sort of uh, happy hack and slash fantasy. Oh, I'm not happy. It's actually a very dark fantasy, but um, very traditional video gamey, you know. Like if you were to, if you wanted fantasy video game in like the background of a movie, this is the this is the game you would put on, you know. Uh, what's this? Holy shit! Oh, a gravestone at the sea. 
That's actually kind of nice. Huh. Yeah, that's the other thing is, because it... That's why I say Elden Ring's a good comparison. There's motive to just go and explore. Um, do I have an extra port crystal? If I do... Yes, I can leave one here. Good. I can come back to this little bit of exploration later. Let's head back to town. But yeah, um, hopefully we find a, a good big monster I can show off on the way to the final battle. It should be, but, yeah, hard to say. They, um, but yeah, other than that, you know, you upgrade your gear, you collect materials, you do side quests, you get money, you buy new gear. Good, good, good old standard high fantasy, you know? All right, Alina, you are Max. What is your reward for maxing out your vocation? Let's find out. It is. High Bolide. Oh my. And High Petrifaction. Nice. Well, let's get High Bolide at least. That's been very useful. Um, other than that, Articulacy. Oh, that's extremely useful. That's your actual main reward. <laughs> Okay, and with that, you're done. And if so, okay, I gotta sort one of these out. Damage, enchantments, augments. Uh, we will swap out whatever that is for articulacy. But you, I'm actually not leaving as that job. Because now that it's maxed and we got the main reward, I'm putting you back down to mage. Because I want you to be able to have healing spells. That's important. Just like that. It's your turn to uh, get the burly gear. You get favored canopy. Um, that was something we found a while back and it's all yours. I believe the twilight hood is still the best hood we have for you. Yeah, pretty much. Um, uh, put those on, and I don't think any of these are better. Um, oh, you can put on the silver chest plate. Yeah, you may as well. No harm in that. Um, I'm not putting her in the princess gear. Everyone in this game uses princess gear, and I hate it. It's kind of ugly. Unless you're specifically going for the princess look. Like, nah, I'm good. Uh, yeah, so we'll leave that. You can put those on as well. Nice. And we'll check your skills. Which, I believe, yes. You can't learn the big ones, but you get to carry over all your augments, which is pretty powerful. So I'd say that's pretty good. Okay, that's that and that we... Oh, fuck! Uh. Yeah, yeah, I, I know, I know, I hit the wrong goddamn button. Yeah, yeah, do I have a skeleton key? No. Sir, sir, I'm sorry, I'll pay the fine. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> That's what happens if you slap someone. Damn, I gotta... Oh god, I hit the button again. Imagine if I just punched someone. Yeesh. Okay. <laughs> so don't accidentally hit the attack button. It ends poorly. I don't need these. Alright. Pop that, pop that, grab that, grab that, get that, knock that out, slap that, do that. Okay. Put the goddamn sword away. Or the mace, whatever. You get the point. Ah. Uh. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. The other thing I was going to do, now that we are our final classes, was spend some of this gold. 
We gotta we gotta barrel ourselves up a little bit. Cause we we got the money to do it. First, put away the stuff we don't need, which will be a little bit. Just save on inventory space. Oop. Uh, I believe I don't have anything else. No, but you will have, yes, that. And those. There we go. And those as well, why not? There is Caxton's Armory. Um, who I don't think is going to have anything better for me. No. Nope. So, what happened? What does this replace, anyway? Oh, no, it replaces the sword. Oh, there we go. Um, I don't think anything burly there. Nope. Anything there. Not quite. Nothing's really up in the numbers, so to speak. Not there either. A little bit, but not enough to be worth it. How about on you? Let's check. Nope. Mm, nope. 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 Hmm. Did I save all this gold for nothing? The answer may surprise you, because it's probably a yes. Okay, so I can get you a better, um, like, piece of, uh, yeah, a better staff. That's the word I'm looking for. But there's actually even burlier staffs we can get. So since the armor is a non-factor, we can go ahead and real like, when I said burn the money, we're really about to burn some money. Like, uh, all of our money on a single item sort of burn our money. Hello, sir. What have you got for me today? You have... Uh, some good stuff, but... Nothing that compares on weapons. How about for Alina? You have... N oh. Also nothing. Why... Do these cost so much? Is it because they look... It's because they look good, isn't it? Oh, uh, it is... It's totally just because they look good. Well. I feel like I've just wasted my time. Anything here? No. Nothing here? No, here, no, here, no, and oh, well then, it seems I have wasted my time. Alright, I guess we're going back to buy that, uh, that one staff and then that's it. So much for like... Uber weapons costing 200k, those are just the friggin' style points. I don't know where the Uber weapons actually are in this game. They're probably in the DLC island. That would make sense. Hey, give me the thing. With the stuff. Yeah, yeah, that thing. Give me uh, the uh, cast stone. There it is. Uh, yep, highest by a truckload. Go ahead and equip that. And then we enhance. Thousand stings, max. Well, not to max, but as close as we can. As close as we can for the Thunder Kite. Really? Did... Did Ro could Raw not come in here and say that himself? Also, of course I smell. I smell like stainless steel because I am a robot. At least I think this is stainless steel. I don't actually know what I'm made of. I should probably get that checked. Oh, hang on. Carstone. There we go. 
to max. Silver chest plate up again. And the mystic robe up again. Jade bangles up again. There we go. Who's to say raw or something? Uh, my view account. <laughs> I, I, I know. Y'all are like in person or something now, aren't you? I, I don't know. I heard something about a convention, so I assume that's what's going on. Anyway, so we're gonna go kill a dragon now, because we're actually the right level for it. Um, yeah, I like these two pawns. They can come with us while we go win. Let's go. We uh, go ahead and where is the thing? Yes, Roar, withheld told me that I smell. Uh, <laughs> it, it, it was indeed relayed. There is no need for any, like, punishment or, or whatever, whatever the thing is. You can, you can pay the messenger. There you go. All, all is well. No, you just, you said, you relayed what, that Roar told me that I smelled. And thus, I was told that I smell. So, it, it, I, it, the point still got across. No, no, hang on, center storage. I want to put away this. There we go. All right. Final boss, final dungeon, final whatever the hell this is. Let's go. Uh, where is it? Um, the final battle. There we go. Yeah, it turns out this final battle quest is named the final battle. Who'd have thunk it? Looks <laughs> like the point got across. Exactly. Exactly. Hello. I don't know what's so tainted about this mountain. I mean, it's just a mountain. I don't know what it smells like. Just know there is a scent. Yeah, that's what I that's what I said. I like it smells like metal. I just don't actually know what metal because I I, I mean I don't check very often. You think I'd, I don't I don't have like a local engineer to to be like, hey, what am I made of? Okay, where am I going? Okay, down that way. Got it. Unobtainium. Nah. If that were the case, I'd have sold my legs a long time ago. Like, I can get by with just, like, one little wheel. It's a lot easier to replace if it's not made of unobtainium. Do you know how expensive that shit is? Literally infinite. Thus you did tread the path of all true risen to face the dragon and learn the real truth. Because you are a digital, therefore your ally is unobtainable. Oh, oh, I see what you're getting at. Um, yes, my consciousness is digital, so that makes sense. Uh, but as far as like my actual body, I, I couldn't tell you. I gotta figure out what this gem in my chest is made of, too. Is it a gem? Hang on. Tink, tink, tink. Uh, I don't know. Maybe it's like a, a power source or a core chip or something. Oh, yeah, these are all questions I really wish I had asked my maker before I killed him. Um, why are there two paths here? Oh, I guess I'll go this way first. Sounds funny. Cleric's Incense, which that guy stole from me. A pit, always fun. Oh boy, poison. I wonder what that's doing there. Okay, let's go. Oh, 
Hey, it's the pot from the intro. Oh, shit. Sorry, Ince. Hello. Here, I'm gonna cut off your tail with a mace. Or, I guess he will. Alright, come here. Uh, and it, Sayo, if you're still here, that's the other shoot you can do in this game. It's really funny. In, in answer to your earlier question of what do you do in this game. You throw shit off of cliffs. It's great. If it weren't for the fact that I don't currently have a way to get them back, I'd pick up one of these pawns and throw them off a cliff. Oh, hello. He's hiding in the corner. Okay, I'm gonna need you to, like... Oh, well, down he goes. All right. Let's press on and on and on. Uh. Oh, so that's Skydance. Neat. Did you get like get? Hang on. There we go. Uh, wait. No, that was wrong. Never mind. Okay, could you get down from there? There we go. Listen, I just really need you to die, okay? Thank you. That's very important to me. <laughs> I should have stayed as warrior. Swinging a mace so big I can't hold it properly. Yeah, I could use my spells, my, well, not spells, but skills a bit more as well. Mintry herb. Herba. Smoke of that herb. That grass. That marriage image. Yeah, hold on, hold on, I gotta cast the, there we go. Bonk, bonk, bonk. Bonk, bonk, bonk. One a lizard, two a lizard. Bonk, bonk, bonk. Nice. I oh, know, not potent acid. As opposed to, like... I don't know enough about music to make, like, an acid um, music joke. I know that's that is, like, a thing. But I... I I can't. I'm sorry. I failed you all. I'm gonna shut down now. Good night. Alright, I'm back. <laughs> uh, they're not that strange. They're actually extremely normal. We fought hundreds of them. Hang on. What's that? Hey, I can still do that. Except I just punch him. Punch! Hey, Elena, if you could not die, that'd be great. Punch! There we go. Uh, I guess that's not... Oh, ooh. It's a secret! It's a secret. Alright, are those gloves any good? Probably not. Nope. How about for Elena? Literally can't use them. Alright. Whatever. Probably be good if I was a strider or something. Alright. Ooh, the holding room. No, honey, it's a romantic fantasy. I'm the holder, and you're the holder's wife, who has to live with me in the holding room. I wonder if I made that joke when I started this game. I probably did. Oh, my, my sense of humor is just a, like a 
round circle. As opposed to a square circle. Um, which isn't squared circle a wrestling thing? Because it's, it's the circle, but it's a square. Oh, I know that was a Final Fantasy XIV joke at one point. It's the dueling circle. Um, it's a square. Slap, slap, slap. Slap, slap, slap. Uh oh. Oh, no, wolves! We all know what they like to do. Eat people. Also hunting packs. Um, that wolf just breathed fire? I'm sorry? Uh, did you... He just carried away Seve. That wolf is shooting fireballs. Okay. That's different. Definitely caught me a little off guard there. Can't argue with that logic. Oh my god. Oh god. Help. Please help. Help. Seve. Oh god. Please someone cast the... Oh god, we are going to die. These wolves are going to murder us. Okay. Alright, and I'm gonna need you to chill the fuck out for a second. Stop. I'm dead. God damn it. <laughs> okay. Wolves are, um, they do not, they got, wolves got, damn, wolves, oh my god, I've got to start all over again. Oh, I should have healed. Okay. Lesson learned. Uh, yeah, damn, wolves got hands. Alright. Speedrun mode. Oh boy, Argents. What the fuck's an Argents? What the fuck is a Sonic? And other references. Only $9.99 at your local hardware store. I missed this last time. Raw Mantle. I already have better gear than that. Alright, I'm gonna need you to, like, die. Also, I'm gonna cast a spell. Did you just... Oh. Please don't fall off and die. I'd really appreciate it if you didn't fall off and die. Alice? Alice, I'm gonna need you not to die. Oh god, I better not die. Alright, Alice, just stay there. I'll go tell... I'll, I'll walk far enough away to teleport you up. It'll be fine. Don't worry about it. Also, there's another one over here. I'm gonna slap it. Ow. Alright, now I can pick you up and throw you off the cliff. Bye! We do not need a lantern. Oh boy, the harpies are back. The harpies nuts! Alright, except they don't, because they're all female. Alright, could you like... Get the fuck off. You are literally my spellcaster. Can you please aim up? Well, my strider, maybe? Anyone? Oh my god. There we go. Hey, and there's that vocation rank up. Oh, please stop! Boy, if any of these ranged um, attackers could, like, attack at a range, that'd be amazing. I don't even have you all. I should have been the friggin' archer. There we go. And onwards we go to more murder. Hello. Ooh, two tails, right in a row. Uh, 
Now see, if I could do that to my weapon, I'd be all set. I literally wouldn't need anyone else. Left you to ow. I'm gonna need you to not have a tail anymore. All right. I do like that knocking off the tail forces them to be quadrupedal because they can't stand up properly anymore. It is a nice way of going about it. Block in the middle of an attack, kind of, and uh, not really. That's a lot of murder, which I would say is a good thing when we're in a video game. In real life, uh, maybe not so much. Black leather gloves, isn't that a Dark Souls item? Let's not read into that too much. Did Demon Souls act steal from the dragons? Maybe. Does Bruno demons his souls? All right. Through the door, get on the floor, I will kill a dinosaur. I mean, that's basically what the dragon is, so, you know. God damn it. Stop command grabbing me. Oh, hello. Oh god! Well, that happened. Uh, stop eating me! Okay, I'm gonna get goaded with the juice right now. Ow. Okay, gonna get uh, some milk. Drink your milk. Drink your milkerism! Oh god. I need you to not right now. Uh, matured? There we go. Uh, magic, strength, sight. Uh, just give me more salt. Give me more juice. What kind of juice does he drink? There we go. Oh, stop! Stop it! Get some help. Okay, I'm gonna just use this thing and then get goaded with the sauce. Okay. Oh, you're dead up there, aren't you? Well, shit. Okay, that's not great. God damn it, get off of- Oh, I'm getting real sick of this area. He didn't fall over. God damn it. I'm gonna go get her up. Otherwise we're getting fucked. No, don't fade. I need you. Ah. Get up! Stop. 
Oh my god. I'm sick to death of these goddamn grapples. Get out. Lena. Get off. Fall over. Come on. I'm going to end you. There. <sighs> Next. Come here. Pick up a wolf. God damn. Now, last time we came through here, the king had like 20 million guards on his side. Where are they for me? I'm fighting this shit with my own two hands. I'd rather fight a chimera than these damn things. I swear to God. <sighs> I'm gonna need you to stop. Just end. Cease. Desist. Oh, please don't tell me you have a blood nose. Oh, that'd just be it today, wouldn't it? I don't think so. I think it's just my nose being fucked as usual. Speaking of a chimera. Oh, it's one of the evil ones. How about that? Alright, grab on. Cut this damn tail off now. What healer? Cut this damn tail off. Why is there like. Yeah, this. Weird. Alright, whatever. I don't know what that's about. Figure it out later. Ah, did you seriously die again? Get up. Oof. That's the plan. Okay, that's not so great. Come on. On the tail. Hold on, damn it. Tail's off. There we go. Alright. 
Alright. Get fire counter out. So we're gonna be shielding. There we go. Keep it going. Yes, keep falling over. I'll keep going this burly combo I got. There we go. Keep slapping. Keep slapping. Keep it on fire. Yes! Here we go. Good head stab. Boom! Gotcha. Black Freakish Mane. Hell yeah. Huh. That was spicy. Melorian Helm. What the hell was that? Is that a good helm? Is that better than what I'm using? Yes. Oh my god, it's butt ugly. Ah. Oh. oh god, no. Yeah. Oh no, I'm not wearing that. I refuse. I refuse to wear that. Alright, I'm gonna need you pawns to like stay on these. Cause we need to hit like four of them at once. Last bud juice. Galvanic razors, which don't really matter for me. That one's down. Okay, no, we all need to hit like all of them once or something. Okay, and then it's just this one. Come on, we're heavy enough. You can go down. I know I'm fat. There we go. Door is no longer stuck. As they say. In the memes. The Tainted Mountain. This is beyond where the intro showed us. Make sure you're amply prepared. Yeah. I'm as prepared as I'll ever be.
still my heart, and you stay the coming end. Another path before you is to offer up that which you hold most dear. I don't actually hold it most dear. Yeah, well, I ain't saving her for her sake. I'm saving her. Because fighting you? That's the only way I'm going to rule this land. As if I'd ever take it over through a bargain. Let's fucking go. Maybe. But it's mine to make. But better fool than craven. I knew your mind ere you came. Still, I ask this final time. Arisen, will you stand and fight? Yes. Your choice is made, Arisen. As you have willed it, so shall it be. Let's fucking go. Alright, the thunder counter up. Let's go. What the hell? Uh, if you're sure, I'll take your word for it. I'd love to just jump at him, but I suppose it wouldn't take much for him to end me right now. Ah, oh, fuck me. Yeah, okay, fair enough. Can't argue with that logic. Uh, can I get, like... There we go. Let's get the hell out of here. Here we go. Come here, you. The heart. And it's hoppy under it. Oh, fuck me. Okay. Uh, I see we're in traditional D&D &D levels of dragon fire. Don't fuck with dragon fire. Got it. Understood. Let's try that again. We can hide behind those. Alright, got it. There we go. Back the fuck up. Skeleton strike from above. Strike from above. Uh, yeah, they ain't working right now. Sorry, love. They're trying to break through. Well, anything. This is just a bonus DPS phase, I think. What the hell? Did you die back there? I need you to get the fuck up. Wake the fuck up, Samurai.
Oh, that ain't good. Alright, spring water while everyone's awake. Uh, yep, alright. Yeah, just a bit. We need to knock him over. That's what the... That's the advice we were given. That it is. You know what? Go up! Ah, damn. Okay, we can't stand on it. Need to reach in stamina a bit. Lena, get up. Where did she go? Oh, no, they're not actually dead. They're just falling over. He's getting the dragon breath ready. Not so great. Yeah. I'll just, I mean, I can figure out where that is. You fall out, you... Fuck. There we go. Alright, let's see if we can scale this thing. I want to hit its wings. Nope. That is not happening. Okay, that was a good time for a shield, I guess. There we go. In the ice counter going. Just in case that happens again. Can I hit its tail? Yeah. There we go. That's it. The heart's... There's the heart. Now we can see it. Oh, speaking of... Okay, buddy. Okay, Grigori. Look at the climb. Can we save here? No. Alright. Let's regenerate while we're here. He's waiting. I have a very bad feeling about all this. Watch your step. Oh, this is a place to fight a dragon, ain't it? Speaking of souls, you know, I don't have a bow, and yeah, we're not, we ain't fighting them here. Let's get the fuck out. We gotta get out of here. Yep. And, oh, don't fall off. That would be a bad way for this to end. Yeah, come on. Okay. To the right. Keep it going. Come on. What can I, what do I have to regen stamina? I'll oh, eat that while I'm at it. There we go. We are getting out of here. All right, upstairs. Dragon hide braces. Hey, those better than what I'm using. 
Oh, I literally can't use them. Okay, never mind. Don't use those. Don't use that. Did you pick up a skirt, by the way? I thought someone did. Alice did. Flame skirt. Yeah, uh, could you give that to Alina? Thanks. That ain't yours to use. That's better, yep. Put it on. This home once stood proud and firm. It was the foolish decision of a man too weak that brought it down. On the rooftop? Yeah, that sounds about right. Let's go! Thanks for taking shots. Makes me feel a little better about bringing you along. Uh, you ever get the feeling they built the entire game around one boss fight? <laughs> oh shit. I, uh, ain't doing that. I'm trying to get past him here. Let's go. Alright. This isn't a hill, but yes. Okay. Give us a taste of the ballista. Ballista? Oh, that's a good sign. the idea. Champions Bengals. I'll take my house. Dragon Band. Luna Momento. Oh, now that. That I will wear with glee. Hmm. Bengals. No. Those. Give those to Alina. Wear those. On the ballista. Oof. Okay. That wasn't so great. Uh, can I combine any of this to make something a bit burlier? Nope. Walks trout. Nope. I'd really love to be able to make something a bit... Wait. Something unknown? Yeah. Is that better? Nope. Sitting here like, how, how, boy, it'd be good if I actually knew how to make healing items. The Verdrigus concoction. Is that healing? Be nice if that was healing. No, it's not healing. Rip. Ah, oh, whatever. Stamina, yeah, just drink the sauce arisen. Where is he? Got him.
I get the dragon's hot. Come on, climb along the scales. The spikes are good handholds. Oh, that's a great sign. What do you mean AD? No, I'm wiggling. Come on, nearly there. Get on the damn thing. Not entirely sure what just happened, but I'll take it. The hour for turning back is past. The world will have its answer. You or me. Death or life beyond. Let's go. That's a monster under attack! Come on. And that's the dragon's breath taking me down. Yeah, okay. Saw that one coming, huh? Let's try that again. The hour of returning back is past. The world will have its answer. You or me. Death or life beyond. I gotta get on his stomach. There we go. Got you off. No, you don't. Yeah. Okay. Now I know what he's going to do after that, so we're just going to go ahead and real quick. Do I have anything that uh, would reduce my damage from fire? Hmm. I'll, I'll consume this, though. Hit the legs. Just like Montana. Come on. Oh, 
Oh, that ain't good. Oh, fine. That'd be nice. Yeah. I'm working on it. Good idea. Working on it. You found smothered sir? Damn. That'd be useful. Ha, ah, you missed. Fine. There we go. Hey, have you got a weak spot on your back? Doesn't look like it. That's fine. Oh, hell yeah. That was a block. Yes! Come on! Need to knock you over. Alright. Any ice counter. on it. Uh-oh. Let it go. There you are. Oh, that ain't great. There we go. Get on that heart. Oh, that ain't... I don't need you all the... There we go. Come on. Big damage! Big damage! Ugh. This is gonna hurt. Oh, not that much. I'll take it. What else have I got here? Stamina. Uh, stamina. So the skills. Fair bit of health and stamina. Yeah. Use more juice. Let's go. This is but a flesh rune. Really? Now of all times. Oh yeah. I gotta trust his shield more. I oh, know you don't. Damn. There we go. Damn. Hey, can one of you give me a heal? No, you don't. Ah, oh, you son of a bitch. Is that a heal? I'm gonna go get it. Hey, nice. What are you doing?
Can I climb up this? Because it doesn't look like it. I'm gonna need the archers. Good luck, thanks, beloved. I definitely need it. Oh, man. One more for me. I don't know how to get him down from there. Oh, there we go. Yeah, I was just waiting. Okay. Oh? You gonna come at me, bro? One of us does. Alice? No. Not so great. If you could get that heal off, that'd be wonderful right now. Huh, I'll spot juice. There we go. Oh. Oh. Oh, fuck me. Okay. If that's how we're doing this. Is that fire? That's on fire. No, that's fire. Seve. Come on, buddy. Come on. The fire. Nope, that's fire. Damn it! Hey, Archer, I really need you to shoot your bow at this thing. Fire? Fire. I don't know. No. Nope. I'm here, Seve. I gotcha. Nope. Okay, this is problematic. Let's go take cover. Gonna have a bit more trouble hitting us in here. Little Brius Brew. And a balmy incense. And some housebud juice. Are there nothing? That's what I've been asking. Is there a ballista? Actually shit, there might there is. Fuck. Should have seen that coming. Oh. That does it! We need stamina. Uh, fair amount of health and stamina? Yeah, that'll do. That's more like it. Um. Um. Okay, stamina again. Okay, I don't know what that was, but I dodged it. There we go. I'm out. Wait, you got Seve? Hey, yo, free Seve. There we go, nice! Seve took that for me, holy shit.
Keep it going. Just keep attacking. Come on. Get him. Oh, bastard. I ain't done yet. I'm getting back on there. Come on. Into the heart. Come on. There. Ooh, CG cutscene. The hell? Um... You ever fall? Holy shit. I, I think the Everfall just opened up. Whatever abyssal monster's down there. Arisen. You have earned back what is yours. Oh, cool. I have a heart. Neat. Ah, we just broke their immortality. It's only fair. So I was just waiting for credits before I say much more. Oh, yeah, and then there's this bitch. I did not want her to be my beloved. I was hoping for Celine. Okay, there <laughs> we go. <laughs> Streamers usually get confused? Uh, that? Really? That made perfect sense to me. The dragon forged and the duke died because their hearts were given back just like ours. The Everfall, whatever, that's cl the Everfall, right? That's literally what opened up beneath Grand Sauron. And the dragon died. That, yeah, that makes perfect sense. And yeah, thank you for the GG. It's nice having someone here for the finale. Well, not the finale. 
I intend to do Bitterback Isle, and I want to fight all of the big monsters at least once. So I'm gonna go hunt down a Hydra, Arch Hydra, uh, ha have a shot at the Erdrag and stuff like that. And I know there's the post-game quests. <sighs> it could have been Selene. Shame. What? Val, Val, I don't know actually who that was. Val, whatever was voiced by Hatsune Miku, gasp. This was a good game though. I, I like it a lot. I mean, it's basically Monster Hunter, but what if it was an open world fantasy RPG? I dig it. Yeah, you know, the com the combat honestly carries this game. The combat is a treat. Like I am so happy the Dragon's Dogma Two is the thing because I want more of this combat. I just want more like grappling and magic archers, hack and slashing weak points. It's such good shit. Yeah, the story is a bit light, but that's fine. I wasn't really here for a heavy story. I was here for an action fantasy. And that, it absolutely nailed it. Who knows? Maybe by the time Dragon's Dogma 2 comes around, I could be a popular enough streamer to get an early look. That'd be nice, wouldn't it? Ah. Nah, this, this game's a good time. I like it a lot. I can finally say I've beaten it, even if I'm not done, as I said. Alright, Queen, now when we get into my house, you're going to see Celine, my actual wife. Um, so I'm just going to need you to not freak out about that. So, what happens now? Oh, we just rested in an inn. Okay. Also, doesn't this mean, like, all my upgraded gear gets Dragonforged now? That's cool. Um. Wait, Nameless Terror got cancelled? Why'd that get cancelled? Oh. Oh, well, whatever. Doesn't matter that much. Hey, Selene, what's up? But I would be wrong. After what has happened here, I... Oh, Selene, you're still the best girl. would never abide my having there was a but when the moment came that you okay anyway um so yeah i guess nameless terror is over with that's a shame oh well so we've got new game plus well not new game plus we've got the post game now is that it or also oh hello what's up yeah, we kind of did just leave it. We didn't really go and have a proper look at all that. And yeah, um... I don't... I th is all my shit dragon... All my shit is dragonforged. Okay. Nice. Hell yeah. Looking snazzy in that armor. Oh, we even replaced, like, the worst part of it, which was the helm. Holy shit, though. Dragon's Faith as, like, a weapon. Oh, as a shield. Just gonna put that on. And holy shit. Okay, yep. <laughs> I have a new weapon now. What is that? Dragon's Toll. 
God damn. That's a boost. That's a bo fucking boost. Alright. I mean, the sky's green now. Yeah, that's usually a sign of peace and tranquility, right? Yeah, we're not done yet. Yeah, yeah, it's fine. Don't worry about it. Uh, what we got? Escort. Geosaurians. Yes. Yes, yes. Just let me let me deposit some stuff so I'm not overweight for the post game. Here, take take all of those, and and those, and those, and that, and that. Excellent. And that, and that, <laughs> and I think that's it. Okay. So you say streamers usually get confused by that ending? Is that like, is that actually the case? Or am I, like, making assumptions? Because, like I said, it makes sense to me. Uh, also, forgetting the Grand Sorin, Nice and easy there. Godsbane. Has the power to guide the Trojan to true freedom. Um, mm, I'm a little concerned about that. I don't want to use that yet. Uh, that's not, like, the New Game Plus blade or something, is it? Like, if I hold it, I go to New Game Plus. Because I wouldn't want to do that yet. Uh, it's Fairy Stone. Go back to Grand Soren. Whee! And we're back! Well met, Arisen. We've been awaiting your return. I figure what with the giant hole in the city. Waste no time on us, sir. The Duke awaits. I fear for the others in the castle besides. Though too small mercy to be spared, only to face this world. Perhaps we'll all be wishing the earth devoured us here long. Okay, I'm not allowed to go in the ever four yet, I guess. So what does this place look like right now? Oh, yeah, that's, um... Huh. Yeah, well... Shit. That's... That is gone. That is just... There, it ceased. Well, damn. Okay, then. Uh, well... Let's, uh... Well, let's upgrade this talon and shield, this weapon and shield we got. Yeah, he's still doing, he's, he's working his trade right next to the giant fucking hole in the ground. That's fine, that's, that's just a normal everyday thing around here. Oh, wait, no, all my other stuff's Dragonforged, I don't need to worry about it. Sounds a little over Grease Gun Fix, yeah. That's a bit, bit of spit shine here, like a plank over there. Just look upon it, turn back. Oh, you're telling me don't go through? Oh, yeah, no, fair enough. That's that's not a way I'd want to go to castle. Um, I'm gonna look up what that Godsbane does real quick because I'm curious. Hang on, Godsbane, Ragnar's Dogma. Godsbane, um, those who yeah 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 yeah. Uh, the bane must. Uh, what is it? Okay, it's post-game shit. Got it. Got it. Post-game shit. We'll worry about that later. I like how they're like, go check on the Duke. And I'm like, mm, he's gonna be looking like, uh, Graham, looking like Gandalf right now. The Duke is like to be in his solar. Yeah, uh, wait, that respawned? I respawned. This is a different map. We must find answers. The game's cheating. If this isn't Grand Sorin, it's it's the it's it's to a clone city, San Groran. A pawn's still not allowed in the castle. Cause I'm gonna have words if that's the case. Wow. 
Wow. Okay. What? <laughs> oh boy. Oh. What's up? Peace. All right, Duke. What's up? What do you got for me? What's up, Duke Nukem? You dead? You. You met with the dragon. More than met. Hello? I'll be looking like a skeleton in a second. And don't think for a minute. I don't know what you did then. Kill the dragon? Yeah, that was my job. Yep, Syro. Oh god, he's a vampire! No human hands could fell that beast! Well, I mean, you've, you've been proven wrong, sir. Ah, uh, nope, other way around. Wow. Wow, I knew I hated this guy, but like, god damn, son. You're not, <laughs> you're not, you're not really gonna... <laughs> he's gonna have a fucking heart attack and die. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> you, you do that, mate. I'll leave you to it. Uh, <laughs> later. <laughs> yeah, sure I did, mate. Uh, do, do you really lock the door? Uh, uh <laughs> boy, there are some words I could say about that one. <laughs> you good, mate. Okay. Alright, this is a bit. Alright, sure thing. Let's check his documents. Anything funny here? Ooh. Tough. This is a tough to bear under the seat. Amazing. Collecting hair while he's sitting there swinging his heart out. What the fuck is happening? Okay, I'll take the jug too. Come here, buddy. Come on, Grandpa. I'll put you to bed. This bed. Come on. Really? All right. Out the window. Nope. All right. If I have to. Bonk. Oh wow, you survived the hit. Look at you. Look at you, big man. Punch. Bonk. I, I said bonk. There we go. What a fucking... That's a, what a guy, am I right? Absolutely amazing. Uh, hilarious. Upon this land as upon its ruler! 
Just look! Upon the hellish moor, the gapes, where once our city stood! <laughs> Gape. And tell me, this is not the work of the dragon's dark magic! <laughs> uh, you got to be kidding me. You all know you don't stand a chance, right? Yeah, y'all aren't even doing much to- Alright, bye. Peace! I'll just fucking walk away. I don't need to kill him. Ah, so Maximilian. Come on. We're pals! I escorted you that one time. Come on. We're not- we're not killing him. Uh, duty bound, that's up to you, mate. You can refuse orders. That's actually a part of a good soldier. Oh no, soldier. Oh my god. I mean, I gotta end up down there anyway. May as well. Um, oh, so that's why the post game is full of monsters. Hmm. Maybe, um, okay, I'll end. Alright, grab one and write it down. Like Raiden. Look, if you jump into that, you're bound to hit a few on the way down. I'm sure we'll be fine. What? Um... What the fuck? And now the dog's barking. Whee! Now it's gonna be like portal when you put two portals above each other. Oh, that's why it's... That's why it's called the Everfall. <laughs> God damn it. Really? That's why you call it the Everfall? Ah. Oh. Alright. Bonk. Anyway. Alright. Okay. What? Hello. Can I help you? Ask aught of you arisen. Please take this. Oh, shit, it's John Quincy Adams. She gathered there like as she sought her way through the depths. She died as she was done. If you would take up her task, pray bring them here to me. What? I trust that you will see my mistress' will done. Sure, why not? I shall await you further on. Bye. Oh! She's gone. Just fucking disappeared. Alright, what are we doing now? We're gathering stones? Gather the stones. Okay. Well, I guess we'll start wondering. Hello, who are you? Toothpaste! Amazing. Huh. So I guess now we're in the infinite home to all pawns and the different universes that make up Dragon's Dogma 
because the Everfall or something. I don't really know. What is this place? Uh, Chamber of Confusion couldn't be more appropriate. Eh, we just gotta find 20 of these things. It's not that hard. Hello. Our descent was slow work and hard won. In the end, it claimed my master. So they're talking about other arisen, right? This place is home to fearsome creatures, sir. Take care. Like, uh, like other universe arisen. The pawns that haunt this place who attack any they see. I know not the cause of their corruption. Perhaps no one does. Okay. Well, I, I guess we're just wandering. I'm a wanderer. I'm a wanderer. Boop. Oh shit! New monster! Beholder! The fuck? Oh, one of its tentacles grabbed me. Okay. Hmm. I don't know how to hurt this thing. That's a little awkward. Okay. Yeah, this is awkward. Alright, let's um let's try and figure this out. Oh, it was this thing sending the tentacles up way back when. Okay. Oh no, I'm blind anyway. Am I a warrior? I'm a mystic knight. Which, um, I actually... I kind of needed, like, more... T I, I don't have enough of skills yet, but I, I'll get them eventually. Alright. If y'all mages could, like, cast spells, that'd be amazing right now. Alright, Alice, I need you to not be dead, okay? Thank you. Here we go. Oh, that hurt. Okay, I'm fine. Let's heal. It's basically nothing but tentacles, guys. A tentacle off? And someone tells Zone Summer. Oh, that fell off. Okay. There it is. Anti boss, basically. I probably should have grabbed its eye out, huh? Hello. No. Bonk, bonk, bink. Bink, 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 bonk. Bink, bink. Bonk! Bing, bing, bonk. Hey! Achievement unlocked, eye contact. I get it. Because it's an eyeball. Nice. Oh, that was fun. Uh, I guess we leave now. Alright, peace.
Both warriors? Well, I think you're meant to target the tentacles. And then, eventually, it just opens up its weak spot. At least, that's, that's what I was doing. I don't know if I was doing it wrong, but... Alright, well, I guess now that we're done here, we can, like, go jump into the pit again. And see what else we come up with. Because I, I assume our goal is to just keep going until we have enough wake stone shards. Yeah, okay. Can I, like... Um... Alright, whatever. Might have thought you needed magic, yeah. One moment. You gotta love when, um, you know, you're in the middle of something and you're just blindly interrupted. <sighs> God. Oh, Jesus Christ! Okay, hello. Alright, I'm gonna need you to die. Goddamn zombies. I mean, this is, uh, okay. You really aren't that much of a threat after dealing with the dragon. I gotta be real with you. Which, I guess I did that at, like, mid-40s, which... I feel like it's a pretty good level to have played the game at, as far as challenge goes. Okay, could you stop that? Sir. Sir, this is the Everfall? Pull it down. Since when have we been able to pull anything down? Could you stop there? Thank you. Give me one of them. More shots, please. Thank you. Thank you kindly. And now you're dead. Not big surprise. Okay. Oh, wake stone shards. How many of those have we got now? Is it are we collecting wake stones or wake stone shards? Hang on. We are collecting actual wake stones. Okay. Fair enough. Can't argue with that. More zombies, more zambonis. There's a bloodthirsty brute. Uh, yeah. And? You know what I should do? I should put on fire counter. There you go. Now you're dead. Bonk, bonk, bing. Bonk, bonk, bing. Bonk, bonk, bing. And now you're dead. So I, I guess this is just the generic dungeon crawl part of the game. Uh, Alright, whatever. I mean, I'll do it. I want to see the end of the game today. 
Um, and then we can do, like, bit of back aisle and stuff next time. Hey, quest complete. How's that? Alright. How are you all doing? I've been having fun today. Aside from, you know, getting interrupted for something that I didn't do, but that's just normal around here. I've been thinking about what I'm going to be doing after Dragon's Dogma, to be honest. Because, we look, I say I want to do the post-game. In the end, we're nearing the end of this. So, I got, I got to find something to do next. I don't know. Could always do more Ratchet and Clank. That's always fun. Ratchet Clank 2 would be a good way to fill time. Um, are we fighting another- Oh shit! Yeah, let's go! Let's do it! Come at me, bro! Headmaster, master, cough! Did you just- Okay, no, no, we're fine. Ah, oh, I can't use magic anymore. Alright. Right, you gotta hit it in the belly, don't ya? So actually, I don't need to climb this thing. If I ever looked at one of them carcasses, I'd laugh at how silly it was. No, never look him in the eye. The rest of this fight will be My Little Pony references. As well as YouTube poop references from My Little Pony. Congratulations. Ow. Did y'all cast like a healing spell or something? Thank you. That's not a healing spell. Thank you. That was close. There we go. Come in. Come on. Come at me, bro. Bonk, bonk, ding. And it's up again. Hey, Alice, could you knock it down from up there? That'd be amazing. Alright, never mind. Grab on its tail! Grab its tail! No. There we go. And you are dead. Easy. GG, bro. GG, no re. GG, no re, plus L, plus ratio, plus your mother, plus etc. Alright. Back into the pit. It burns. Uh, you know what might be... Yeah, you know what? I think I will play Ratchet and Clank 2 after this, because... Okay, so hear me out on this, right? Um, Playing a lot of JRPGs right now between Xenoblade 3 and... Um, oh, Brain Fart. Shin Megami Tensei Digital Devil Saga for the JRPG Book Club. Bayonetta 3 is coming out soon. Please don't bring controversy in here when I mention that. I'm just going to play it. I got other shit to worry about. Um, as well as that, we got, what, Pokemon coming out shortly afterwards? Um, I think just a nice action game in Ratchet & Clank 2 would be a good fill. It'd be a good time, you know?
Alright, and we go. We grab. Plus, I I do want to do all the Ratchet and Clank games at some point. I think that'd be a lot of fun as like an extended thing, and they're not individually too long. They're a little bit long, but not not overly so. And it's it's shit from my childhood. I'd love the excuse to keep playing those. And it counts as a robot game, as we agreed, but with Clank. Oh no. Oh god, it's those wolves again. Oh god, I said- They're all on fire! Alright, I'm pretty sure a small nuclear bomb just went off, or the equivalent of such. Alright. Oh, they're hellhounds! That makes sense. Okay. You know, I should have realized they were hellhounds. I think my wake stones. I must admit, this is, I'm having a lot of fun. Is this what Bitterback Isle is like? Because if so, I'm really looking forward to that now. If it's just like a dungeon. That's something this game's kind of lacked up till now. Chamber of Hope? Really? What are we hoping for? Skeleton Sorcerer? Sorry. I can't help myself. Boop, boop. What's that noise? Oh, there's a chimera. Okay. I guess that's happening now. Alright, I'm gonna need you to fall over right now. There you go. That's more like it. Now I can knock off your tail. And the tail's off. Hit the goat, 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 hit the goat. Alright, fall over. Come on. There you go. Hit the goat, hit the goat, hit the goat. Oh, I got stunned. That's not so great. There we go. And the goat step. I think it's getting mad at me. You mad, bro? Oh, you mad you the easiest monster? Um, I really need to res that person, thank you. Can you stop roaring like a... Wow, the, wait, the tail didn't get cut off or did it grow back? I think it grew back. Alright, we gotta like, heal up a little bit so we don't get fucked over. There's Lena. Can you stop stunning me? Uh, he's about to... Oh. Wait. No, that's actually Arena down there. Okay. Okay, keep going, keep going. Down we go. Alright, I guess this is happening now. Oh, God! Please. Get up! Need y'all to stop! Ah, okay. Um, yeah, that'll do. 
I gotta buy some healing items. Like, proper healing. Alright, I'm getting on that tail now that we're down here. And I fell off. Into the poison. Good job, me. Thanks, down. There we go. Now you get to die. Yeah, don't worry, my mace is sharper. That definitely didn't come out right. Alright. Gotcha. You, you probably shouldn't say it like that. It sounds kind of sexual. Which, actually thinking on it, it may as well be. Alright, I want to fairy stone the hell out of here. And, like, have a chance to redo some things. I'll grab these, speaking of. Alright, so that was the end of this path. Let's... Yeah, can I fairy stone out? The game gonna let me? Yes, okay. We'll go back to Casadas because that's where there's actually an inn. Um... I don't know where I can learn skills. Dear chat, where can I go to learn skills? I've been stricken! Yeah, because I don't think the inn in Casadas let you. I like I kind of need to learn some skills. It's a bit important. Alright. Let's go. Hello. I need to clear out my inventory a bit. Please help me make room. An old tooth. No, I'm good. And from the materials alone, I'm back down to average, so take that as you will. Let's rest till morning. Uh, I'm gonna quickly Google. Hang on. Ever fall learn skills. Where can I rest in the post-game content? Here we go. In his move to the pawn guild. Ah, lovely. Lovely, absolutely lovely. That's that's wonderful. Excellent. Once the service done. Taking it sweet time. Draining my batteries. Nah, I'm not battery powered. I'm not entirely sure what I'm powered by. I'm pre again, probably comes back to this like crystal thing in my chest. Boy, I should have gotten those blueprints before I blown down the laboratory. All right, uh, so back to Grand Soren. Now that we know. Nice and easy. Uh, do we want... I think we want new pawns. These two have been very helpful, but I think it's time to upgrade. Also, speaking of upgrade... It's a cock! A triss. Listen, I warned you all. I warned you! I told ya! You shoot, but you didn't believe me! Why didn't you believe me? Hey, you, the other... Let's learn skills, yes, please. Die Rapture. I don't need... To, I'm not using a star, so I don't need to worry about that stuff. Holy wool. Nice. I'll take it. Levitate? Damn. Uh, can't use... Reflect, yes. Adamants. Uh, yeah, sure. 
I don't know I don't have any secret augments, so that's like a thing. Well, I guess that's not a thing, is actually. Okay. Um, yes, so give me additional weight, augments, reduced damage, lethality, physical, greatly augments. You know, um, I would like to keep my footing better. I will trade that. Magic shield, I'll keep fire counter, but swap that for holy wall and demon spite. And I don't use the stuff. And that's upgraded. Excellent. Perfect. Exactly what I was after. Wonderful. Absolutely. Now let's go. Let's go check out pawns. Um, we can we can honestly take any at this point. So I'm just going to let luck of the draw say who we end up with. All right, Alice, you've been extremely helpful. You you helped with one of the biggest things. I'm gonna give you something actually good. So yeah, here have some dragon spit. Wonderful, wonderful combat, um, excelled in all regards. Very helpful. And where is he? Seve, Seve. You have also been extremely useful. Get, go ahead, you get dragon, every, you get a dragon spit, you get a dragon spit, everyone gets a dragon spit. Uh, combat, actively battle, helpfulness. Oft aided the party. This is Wonderful. All right. Don't want George. Don't want Angra. Don't want V. Uh, Zafira. Looking snazzy there. Actually, you're about my level. What are you? What are you got going on? Magic defense. You got. You don't have any skills. Um. Never mind. I would like you to have some skills at least. Jeez, Floki, piss off. Alright, what else we got? Magic Archer would be... Oh, wait, no, they can't be Magic Archers, right. Oh, regular Archer would still be cool. Oh, shit, it's Gandalf! It's him! It's the Gandalf! What do you got going on? High angle and... Oh, you don't even have the high stuff, though. No, thanks. Barrel? What do you got? What do you got going on? Fire Affinity, Brontide, High Sism, High Geisel. Yeah! Yeah, you can come along. Alright, so that's the Mages. Um, ooh, here we go. Cadman. Ooh, look at you. You got skills, right? Yeah, you do. God, oh, come along. You're perfect, perfect fit. There we go, we got Cadman and Beryl now to join us on our adventures. Let's go. Into the Everfall. This must lead back to the Ready? Ready? We. Well, let's just fall for a minute and see what happens. Um, here. Um, oh wait, no. I was like, is that a beam? No, that's the bottom of stairs. Okay. All the world. Yeah, that... Okay, so this is, um... Ah, oh, shit. No, I can't say it, because sailing it would spoil the game. There's a specific 3DS game that did the same thing. If you if you know, you know. Um, thanks. Oh, for fuck's sake. I'm gonna need you to... Okay. Did you just cancel my spells? You son of a bitch. And now my vacation goes up again. So what's Holy Wall like? I... Oh shit, it's like an actual... Nice.
I think I'm sticking with Demon Spite for the most part, though. Die already. Oh, the wrong one. There we go. Thank you. Oh god, there's more. Yeah, don't didn't I give you guys something that could give like affinity? There you go. Astrocyte. Huh. Oh shit, things I can kill. Skeleton sorcerers. Oh, more skeleton sorcerers. Bonk, bonk, bonk. I'm on Wake Stone. Boop. And Pigeon's Blood. I guess we can't have enough of that for some reason. That's about. Oh, I guess that's like me charging it and then using the spell. Okay. That's a little weird, but I guess it adds up. I can't go that way. Alright, back we go. Once more into the infinite. Now I see why a lot of the enemies were listed as post game Everfall. Because it's literally just all of them. Like, everyone. Hey, you gave me an actual... Never mind. Uh, I'm just... I'm just not right now. Hello. Let me kill you all. Hooray! Alright, those. Okay, where's the, like, other exit to this room? I feel like I've been everywhere. Um, over this way, okay. In here? No? No, this is a dead end. But there's a chest. Oh wow, a fairy stone. Clearly I need more of those. Um, this way? Nope. Dead end. Okay, I'm lost. Don't mind me, just eating shit on the floor. Um, that was shot. I'm actually lost. What the fuck is going on up there? Summon a mini hurricane? Really? Uh, alright. Not there. Did I just, like, walk past the other exit? I might have. Oh god, I'm out of stamina. Please slap me in the butt. Okay. Thank you. Uh, alright. There is no other exit. This is just nothing. Well, that was a waste of time. Bunch of phantasms I can't attack properly. Into the pit. We Grab that one. 
And I sure am glad I got them, uh, them their invincible arms. Please tell me someone's made an edit where you grab on, the camera cuts, and it's just like the two arms hanging there because they've broken off at the shoulder. Someone has to have made that. That's like a Prince of Persia joke, you know? All right, what kind of hopes in this chamber? A whole lot of jack shit. Okay. Have I already been in this one? Oh my god, wait. I actually have. Do I actually have to find a new chamber? Oh my god, okay. Well, I was in the Chamber of Confusion, the Chamber of Hope, what else is there? How many wake stones do I have? 17, nearly there. Only three more and then we're done. Okay, so if not that one, we need to grab onto something weird. We Oh, now, oh, we just go through. Okay. I want to go in here. I don't think I've been in this one. No, this looks unfamiliar. Okay. And here we have... Yep, this is new on the map. Chamber of Anxiety. Oh shit, it's my room. <laughs> this this room was made for me. Chamber of Hesitation is a fun one. I don't know if I've found that one yet. Oh, it's a white. Catman, could you not die? Thank you. Carol, are you gonna die? You look like you're about to die. I'm not gonna die high up. There we go. Gotcha. One, two. Come on, I just need one more wake stone. And we're done here. Over here? Wake stone? What's this? Nope. Sauce. Uh, we've become goated with the sauce. Even though we are short a wake stone. Alright, well, this was one room instead of two, and that's a little different. But I guess it did have a boss fight, so it kind of makes sense. Let's see if we can find this Chamber of Hesitation. Once my stamina comes back. Oh, he slapped me. Thank you. Alright, Chamber of Hesitation. Where would that be? Uh, here? Okay, this one still looks new. This could be it. Alright, Chamber of Absence. Okay. It's, what should there be nothing here? Okay. <laughs> I was I was actually really hoping that it was just empty. Ow. All right, hang on. Let me put the fire counter up here. There we go. I 
Actually, these are the first Saurians we're seeing down here. Hmm. Earth Crystal. Uh, yeah, we're still exploring, I guess. Are you a pawn? No, you're a skeleton. Okay. There we go! Pigeon's blood. Boop. Take those. Boop. Wakestone shard. Not quite enough. Boop. Hello. What's all this then? Mardis Talisman. Haven't seen one of those in a while. Oh, wait, is that? Wakestone shard. That's it! That's all of them. Um. Yeah, I want. I want to f keep fighting. Ow! Holy shit! The whole world exploded. I'm out of stamina. That's not so great. Hellhounds are terrible. Yep. That I have learned. Ow. They are... Not fun. Had I known there were hellhounds down here, I would have left. Oh, please! Fuck me, that nearly killed me. As a sorcerer? Oh god, I can imagine. Uh, I can bind this with anything. No, not really. I'm gonna need you all to die. Ow. Stop dragging me off! Ah oh, shit, if it hits- yeah, I was just thinking if it hits me there, I'm dead. Is Mystic Knight Vocation maxed out? No. I switched to it right before doing the final battle. I'm only at, like, rank 4 or something. Okay. Oh, God damn. Yeah, it was a good thing I did, because all the good weapons I've found have been shields and one-handed weapons. And I was a warrior beforehand. Oh my god. You're gonna die. Listen here, you son of a bitch. Dead. Uh, it'd be nice if I get extra wake stones out of this, though. Yeah, I've already got a bonus one. Boop. What a cool and good enemy. Yeah, ranged wolf. Couple extra ones for DLC, yeah. This is the easiest place to get them. That makes sense. Yeah. Uh, originally, okay, so I was saying earlier that my plan was I would do the DLC. What's this? An old grace. Oh, now nah, I'm good. My plan was I would do the DLC and, like, hunt at least one of every monster after coming down here that's like i'm just gonna do the dlc this is satisfying my monster hunt um desires could just hit select but i decided to do that for some reason chamber of absence what's hiding in here goblins Goblins arisen. 
Oh boy, time to spam the AoE attack. Ow. Did you just put me to sleep? Oh my god. Having a goddamn nap over here. You barely even do damage, mate. And there they go. Alright. That happened. Alright, thanks game. I'd like to be able to see what I'm doing here. Wake stone. Giant coin. Noble limbs. Are they still in there? Okay. Seeing overrated, yeah, basically. What's that? Lucky is the pawn able to fight at the arisen side. I am thankful. All right. Um, I'm just gonna fairy stone out and then like come back in and then do that. I'm gonna use one of these because I don't care. I have an eternal one. Yeah, I, uh, yeah, teacher, I think you joined after I mentioned, but my current goal is, like, become a notable enough streamer I can get access to a preview build of Dragon's Dogma 2, which is extremely unlikely, but boy, it'd be nice. Alright, let's put these materials away. You know, said in the same breath as, like, Oh boy, I'd love to be a big enough streamer as, uh, so that I could, um, fucking make a living off it. <laughs> it's Capcom. That is true. Capcom are actually pretty good at that, so you never know. It's years away, yeah. But, it is happening. And that's the important part. They confirmed it, and people were excited. They know we want it. Odds are they either hand out five copies of 50 million. Yeah. Uh, nice. Yeah, just give me some. Magic cannon? Hang on. Hold, hold up. Hold, hold up. Tunnel sigil? No. Uh, now I'm curious. Uh, yeah, I don't really need any of that. I'm good. Paris Lit Sigil is plus manic magic can is OP. Damn. Uh, Alright, so Sky Rapture ain't really doing what I want it to. So, you know what? Sure, why not? <laughs> Let's see what OP looks like. If only we would have had access to Dragon's Dogma Online. If only. Let's get this, like, Dragon Ball Online vibes, where it's just there, but they never bring it over. It's not like I was using Full Moon Slash anyway. I mean, I was, but it didn't really matter. Yeah, but private servers for a game like that, it's not the same. Uh, it's just like, eh, it feels off. What you need is like... What the... Oh. I got totally turned around. I thought I was heading down the Everfall. Let's go. And you need is like, um, instead of private servers, just like one, uh, like hub that's just like, hey, it's not Capcom, but we, this is what we use now. And he's enter your trap and set off the cannon, which turns. So let, let's, hang on. So I got, so I, I the sigil pulls them in. And then the cannon. Okay. Oh, oh my. Okay, that's interesting. Huh. You know, I'll actually get some good use out of that. Uh, I guess we're going over this way. Hello. Oh, it's this thing. Yes, at last. At last, you've gathered the whole of them with them. 
you can summon forth a rift of considerable power. This rift, born of the Wakestone's power, will guide you forward, Arisen. I fear there will be no returning to this place. Yeah, I am. Wibbly, 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 wibbly. We Nice. This is the part where we enter the human realm and fight. Um, I don't know who, actually, I don't know who the director of this game was, but we go fight them. We Here I come, Capcom executives. You're the real final boss. Oh. Okay. I've heard about this Senashal fellow. Well, <laughs> the Aki Itsuno. It's him! I'll not waste time on rhetoric. Defeat me, and take my place as keeper of this world. Neat. Oh sweet, I get to be God! Hell yeah! I saw it awaiting you at the end of your descent. Aye, the same world you've traveled to arrive at this place. A world you may well now inherit. It is a simple proposition, no different than any you faced. Do you know how many gods I've killed? A missable ending? Uh, I'm good. We'll just see what happens. Listen, I'm a Xenoblade player. I've killed so many gods at this point. Uh, he don't- he don't have no health. Come here. Come here. I'm guessing it's if you don't attack him or something. Entire Greek pantheon mood. But are they Christian infinite power omniscient god? Because I've killed at least five of those, not even just in Xenoblade. JRPGs love them that. Oh, it's me! My boobs are bigger than that. Call it divine creation if you must, but expect none of the mercy men seek in their gods. This is cold truth, the unbending reality of a world without corruption. The world and all its denizens are but empty vessels. In that regard, no different than the forms. Without volition, there is no true life. The world falls stagnant, dead as an ocean with no current to guide it. That volition is tempered by the struggle for survival. The decision, just like yours, to fight. Just as the forms need a master's command, so the world thirsts for the will to live. Okay. Let us continue. Show that you are more than an empty vessel, animated by forces unseen. Show that the temper of your soul is strong enough to command far more than mere forms. Show that your will is fit to bind the frame center of this world and hold it fast. Fight tooth and claw. Struggle now and cling to life. Show that living holds worth enough to fight for. Will you claim your right as a risen, 
or shrug the burden and seek peace in oblivion. Just so, one foot after the next, come what may. That is what it means to live. Turn back now, and I will grant you a merciful death. The choice is yours, Arisen. Yours alone. Tis a simple choice, Arisen. Step forward or retreat. Accept the quiet emptiness of a false peace. A false peace. I'm just thinking. Hmm. Never mind, not yet. Why not put an end to it? The praises of the quiet life are sung far too infrequent. Why is this hesitation? You ought to protect, do you not? That's true. Hang on. No, no, this will watch this. This will be funny, trust me. I was expecting more out of that. Oh well. Why would you kill the love of your life? I mean... Is she though? Here. There we go. Now I didn't kill the, the love of my life. All right, God. Yeah, I got the queen. I wanted uh, Celine, but the queen won out. You are close now. So very close to me. Come, brothers. I shall meet you on your own terms. Joined by my own companions of all. You stand now at its end, Arisen. See your journey through. Wow, well, I am okay, Angham, huh? Damn. Ah, uh, that. Okay. What? What the? Huh. Alright. Yeah, he just kind of nuked me. Which is funny, because he was definitely dead. Okay. So that brings back a Grigori.
Oh, I guess that explains where the dragon comes from now. That's nice to know. Alright, now can I go and slap him and have him not, like, fucking nuke me to death? Yeah, yeah, skip the credits. By the way, I had a wake stone, so, like, that didn't even really count. Anyways, bonk. And they're both dead. Come on. Okay, he's just like generically angry right now. Hang on. Alright. Fuck it, let's see what happens. Does that do it or does that just kill me? Nope, that just kills me. What if I grab you, and pull out the sword? Nope. Okay. Something's going weird here. I'm gonna just fucking- I'm gonna fucking die again. Can I outrun him? I can! My pawn might be intellectually challenged? Oh boy. Oh, he stopped doing the nuke. How about that? Um, do I have the right idea and my pawn is actually just stupid? Like, am I doing this right and that's just what's happening right now? I do, okay. Oh, that's happening, man. Let's, let's heal us both up to full. So you stop thinking you need to heal. Alright. Now, now we do it. grab. Nope. Hmm. Okay. Okay, some shit's going down here. There's some serious fuckery going on. I can let her do it instead, yeah. Go! Oh. Alright. Can, can you- Hey, you think you could do the thing? Boy, that'd be nice, wouldn't it? Okay. Alright, I'm gonna let the pawn do it! <laughs> this is not working. At all. So how often does this happen? Uh, is, this, is this a common occurrence? It's an ever wheel. I've never seen that happen. Oh, wow. Ain't that fun. There you go. I didn't do anything. She did it herself. <laughs> she did it herself. Fucking self. Oh, my God. Yeah, you're kind of broken, mate. <laughs> All I've done is to test your will. 
Holy shit. It is the fate of all arisen. We and I are swept up in the current, same as the rest. Each tempers the volition of the next. And the endless cycle continues. Just a bit. He died in one hit. And so, until the coming of a new soul, fit to craft the will to live, someone like you. Until that day, may you guide the world ever justly. Hey, I have one of those. Those who arise to oversee this world are undying, save by this man's kiss. I didn't actually grab it, but okay. I ask that you, as the world's new solution, use it now to vouchsafe freedom to your weary servant. Grant me now this single boon. The fire of my life is spent in guttering. Give me freedom with the kiss of the God's pain blade. If there is aught you wish to know before my death, you need but ask. My knowledge as my own is yours to take. Alright, so you are God, right? The Seneschal is steward to the world. Oh, okay, you're the you're a false god, gotcha. Yaldabaoth, um, god, but power taken from elsewhere. Just as the arisen calls Pon into being and sets them to motion, the Seneschal holds dominion over all living things. Cool. There are those who would call such a being maker or god. Not quite. I cannot deny the claim any more than affirm it. In the end, they are but words. Call it what you will. Such is the office I have served. Just as those before me and you beyond to eternity. New crown swallow. If there is my knowledge, the pawns exist astride the rift. They speak of a multitude of worlds, each infinite unto itself. Right. Limitless in span and lost to time. These worlds extend in an eternal, perfect loop. Just as a ring lacks start and end, so this world has no origin, no final terminus. It just is. If it does, they lie beyond our life. We are prisoners of unpassing time, wandering an unending land. What lies beyond, we cannot know. New crown. If there is of my knowledge, I, there is life in the world, and with it death. Not lasts forever. Each rises and falls in its time. But such is a death akin to that of ponds. They appear in this world and vanish, only to appear again, like bubbles in a mountain spring. As so it is with all that lives within this eternal world. In time, you will come to see it happen under your watch. Someone open my door one moment. I think one of the animals poked their head in. Each beast. Each blade of grass, each human life is born to die and be born again in endless rhythm. Not lasts forever. Yet all persists unto eternity. New crown sovereign and keeper. If there is my knowledge as my own, it's your will is that which led you to this place, and that which turns the eternal wheel. Syro, you're right. Now we are a real anime. We're getting into some friggin' building the world philosophy shit. Along the endless string of life and death, there are some born with a hunger. They yearn for some other, better place. They are the arisen, nascent fountainheads of will. And so the dragon is sent into the world to guide the arisen. 
and refine them, to temper their wills into aught capable of sustaining the world. And so the cycle of our world has ever continued. Is there new crown song? If there is my knowledge, as you wish, Sinisha, and turn it shall in perpetual peace, and ere the day your soul runs dry, the newly arisen will walk their path and come until that day I am defeated. Pray. That was I didn't mean to hit X. Oh well. Good enough. I welcome the release. The only other thing I was gonna check is what happens if I stab myself. I'll just go ahead and Google what other endings there are. This is basically the ending I'd pick anyway. Ah. So now we're here. So I can live or even better. Let's get fucking weird with it. Um, game? But oh, there it goes. Huh. Well, that's different. Hey, Celine! You're like me, aren't you? As my grandmother gave me life, she gave you yours. They gave us death, and with it, the true one. This is the world she wanted for us. All right. So in doing that, we essentially freed our pawn from being a pawn. I feel an odd pride if you punch a god's... Yeah, okay, I wasn't going to be able to read that. Thanks, game. And that's it. Okay. So we became the equivalent of a god for this world. And then we killed ourselves. So we freed the world of god and that cycle. Thus, yep, okay, and now we are one of many. Hey, there's our stats. I'll screenshot that before it goes away. Level 49, Mystic Knight. Two voca- uh, yep, and it's gone! Okay. That's why I'm screen capping these things. Victory is ours. 
So yeah, uh, did we just pull... So we just freed the world from the cycle by making it so there is no one behind... There is no god. Like, we, there's none left. We, ki we killed the only one. Oh, hi, Alice. Wait, what are you doing there? I guess you were just one of them. All right. So the whole, so the dogma was that the struggle to survive is, uh, is of, hang on, um, the goal of, of existence and survival is, uh, itself. It, it is its own goal. Its mere existence sustains itself. Uh, all we did was take God out of the equation. So... Who the world can go on without artificially forcing it. Alright. Honestly, it's pretty simple as far as JRPG stories go. Like, I, quite frankly, it it is it is um a a, chi a child's um fucking bedtime story compared to some JRPGs I've played. That's it. Okay. So that's Dragon's Dogma, besides Bitterback Isle, which if this kicks me immediately into New Game Plus, I guess I gotta go, like, do the Bare Bones basic story before I can go do that. Ah, uh, we'll see. So yeah, I can see why people want a sequel to this damn game. It needs, it deserves one. But, yeah. Alright. I don't need to sit around for super long credits. Cheap and unlocked closure. Loading this to a bound begin from the available in item storage. Okay. Give me the yeah yeah yeah. Yeah yeah, I got it. I got it. Ah, fuck. Do I? We start to know if we can't learn. Begin new game? No. Fuck. <sighs> when did this game come out again? Hold on. Just a moment here. Dragon's Dogma came out. 2012. Yeah, I guess that's before they realized, um, let players hit New Game Plus whenever they want. That was more of a 2015, 2016 realization. <sighs> Alright, so let's run through the intro real fucking quick. Because I want to get to bit fuck the goddamn bit of back aisle. Don't worry, we're in skip cutscene mode, so we can, like, rush. Y yes that's me. Yes, 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 yes. Skip, 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 da di da di da di da di da da Have I really got it? Oh my god. Listen, I need you to slap me real quick so we can skip this part. God damn it, Grigori. I'm blaming you for this.
And then cutscene. Yeah. Hello. Okay, one more hit, please. One more hit, please. Sir? So this is a Wendy's? There we go. Hey, alright. Speedrun mode. Actually, I bet the speedrun in this game is really damn interesting. What? I don't give a shit. Oh, fucking... I... Uh, yeah, 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 whatever. Shush, get the fuck out of my way. Get the fuck out of my way, I'm playing Minecraft. I'm gonna need y'all to just, like, get out the way. Alright, what's the earliest possible point I can go to Bitterback Isle? I said the earliest possible point is when I have my own pawn, which if so, we will go do that right now. Bye, bitch. Ike the Bard, thank you for the raid. Oh. <laughs> Hello. Um, we, uh, well, we actually just finished the game. That is why I am butt naked and running towards the next story beat. Um, we literally just finished. <laughs> welcome, welcome to all of you. We're, we're, we're rushing through the unlock bit of back aisle because uh, that that was the next step on our on our thing and next door channel neighbors hello uh wait what am I doing right <laughs> just risk the pawn that's it yeah so what are you all up to we're, so we all um also playing dragon's dogma What's up? What's go? What's going on? You know. Um. Yeah. Like. Like I say, you've caught in. Um. Am I going to be able to kill this thing with the basic sword? That's a. Yep. Just beat Damon a few times. I don't think I know who Damon is yet. Is that be the back? If so, well, I uh, look forward to meeting him. This is actually my. Well, I guess. <laughs> I guess we're technically on my second time playing the game, but this was my first time beating it. Am I a fish droid? No, these are these are glowy things. They they glow. They're like solar powered. Yeah, a bit of a car like game boss. Nice. All right, I'm gonna. Ah, come on. Hang on. Rook, come here. I've been told throwing you at things is effective. Look like Finn Gills. That makes sense. They do, they do kind of. But no, I am, I am Roboy, Roboboy. <laughs> so I see another B2B. Yeah, I've been um, playing it for a while now, actually. Um, yeah, it it was one of those games that had been sitting on my Steam list for ages, unfinished. Uh, so I decided, you know what? I'm I'm never gonna finish this on my own time. Let's make a stream out of it, especially with the sequel on the way. Like, oh my god, I cannot wait for it. But yeah, thank you for the raid. I, yeah, yeah, that's. I I suppose if if you're after more bitter back, perfect timing because we're we're jumping right into that. Uh, you can take a a squeal. Bad in on intention. 
Uh, I'm not sure what you mean there. Sorry. Form the main pawn. Yes! A little Alina who is a mage. Expect nude mods at the sequel. I mean, listen, if you want attractive nudity, I feel like there are better games than Dragon's Dogma. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna need y'all to- oh, please, just- I'm leaving. Okay. Um... Oh, it's not telling me I can go to Bitter back yet. I guess I gotta do this thing. Wait, do I? What's my- what's my- okay. Wait, no. No, I just think over here. So my own new- Skin textures and that would be low-key horrifying. Yeah, this is New Game Plus. I, uh, I just- Bought the uh, Seneschal, uh, did all that, and then it kicked me in the new game plus before I could do the DLC, so I was like, well, I guess this is happening now. What carries over? Um, seems like everything. It says my items are in storage. Uh, I'm going to go get them once I can switch to the right job. All right, hang on. I got to grab on here. Oh. I just got eaten. Let's do All right, come on. Cut their head off. There we go. Oh, Childerism. That was my um my first time playing this game. I made a Childerism. I actually loved it. Um cuz it basically turned the game into a platformer. But, it meant I was extremely squishy, so wasn't actually the best thing to do. At least for a first playthrough. So I, I went I went with Big Strunk, because everyone loves a Big Strunk woman. Well, let's be real here. I mean, I, I mean, come on, come on. And I made my, my partner small. Alright, let's go, bit of back aisle. Yeah, I I do love the character creation in this game. It just lets you be so varied and lets that variation actually affect gameplay so much. This was also your first playthrough. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> big girls. Everyone love them big girls. Dragon's Dogma 2, um, just let us be like a 15 foot tall. Uh just like play as a cyclo a cyclops, but you're just a big girl. Is a pixie Caesar cut though, yeah. I mean, I've got, uh, I've got my um liter. The game just crashed. <laughs> it crashed. Crashed the desktop. Not even the not responding. Oh my god. <laughs> oh fuck me. This game does not want me to play Bitterback Isle first. It kicks me in the new game plus after I kill myself as God. Oh, that reminds me. I wanted to look up the other endings to this game. Just if there were other endings, I don't know. I know there was the one secret one we got. All right, so there's closure, peace, servitude, solitude, and the great hereafter. All right, well, while Dragon's Dogger boots back up, there's the great hereafter. That's a quest. That's not an ending. Closure is uh, the ultimate ending. Okay, so that's where we kill ourselves. Peace. Um, choosing to return to a peaceful life. Servitude. Uh, that. Yep, I got that one as well. And solitude. Oh, that's where you would sacrifice your beloved. Okay. Um, so I got all of them except return to a peaceful life, apparently. Alright, watch it friggin' delete my save data, or something stupid like that. Like, the save data is corrupted, we are sorry. Nope, alright. <laughs> oh, fuck me, where's it gonna put me? Hopefully just back after we killed the Hydra. Okay, there we go. The game loves to crash during good moments. Well, 
Speaking of, like, ruining good moments, when we were fighting the Seneschal, uh, my pawn wouldn't do the finishing blow. Like, literally, I... Not only did, was my pawn not grabbing and not or not doing the finishing blow, when I did sit there and wait for my pawn to grab him, uh, I didn't even get to attack. My pawn casted a spell... And in the time between the spell activating, they grabbed, um, they grabbed it. So the pawn did all the work, and I didn't do anything. <laughs> so I guess it's only fair they got the good ending. And thank you for the follow, Ike. Yeah, definitely. Um, yeah, it's I, I say you're you're in for I guess more of this. I oh, and thank you for the follow after. Uh, around here, we tend to do a lot of, um, I would put it as dark, retro-spirited RPGs. Um, you know, Kingsfield, even El Elden Ring at one point. I can't wait for the DLC to that. Alright, um, I should be able to access the inventory from, uh, Bitter Back. Let's go. So, Souls and their ilk? Um, th that's... Th a good, a good quick explanation of it would be Souls and similar to Souls, yeah. Like, we're playing through the Gothic series as well, if you've heard of those. Alright, rest till nightfall. But yeah, I love, love me some retro RPGs. Which, are, I guess at this point, this, this kind of is. About Gothic? Uh, Gothic. It's a r really old, um, series. Uh, it's like 2001? Around the time Morrowind came out, honestly. Um, just some neat, dark RPGs. And, uh, Syra, yes, I have started Digital Devil Saga. I've been playing that in my own time. Just like making bad puns and th phonetic jokes, fair enough. I mean, the best part of Gothic was when the goth went ick on everybody. And he said, it's Gothic time. You know, Gothicking time. Gotham time. Alright, let's go. And time to never leave Bitterback Isle. Because this has everything we will ever need. Alright. As quick, right? Well, obviously, because people probably finish the game and then put it down. But when the DLC comes out, you don't want to make them play through a lot of the game again. Like, that's what I would have done. So, obviously, you release the DLC, you make sure people can get to it really quick. Alright, so let's go over to our proper vocation. Alina's actually on the right one. Let's go get the good shit out. Give me the that uh no, I need the tell Dragon's Toll and Dragon's Faith. Give me my Dragon Helm, Dragon Band, whatever. Uh what's my other Dragon Forge stuff? There it is. Dragon Leather Vest. Do I have a better piece? Oh yeah, the good shit. <laughs> oh god. No, not wearing that. Uh, yeah, that was the good shit. Nice. Mystic Knight, yeah. You're used to the Dark Souls thing of the DLC is somewhere in this world behind a key item we will not just give you go find it. Yeah, that's a little more fair when the game doesn't force you into New Game Plus. Which Dark Souls did, but they only added the DLC on the PC release, so it makes sense. And then PS4 was like, oh, PS3, 4, whatever. They they got it too, but it was like, hey, that's that's the intent. But yeah, Mystic Knight with the uh, Griffic gear mostly. Alright, uh, I want them and Link Strike. Oh, that's no, I don't actually want those. Give me that one. Alina, your turn. You get. Um, that and that. And you get your best gear, which I believe was the alchemical cloak? Or was it the harpy cloak? No, it was the alchemical. Okay. 
get your best leggings. Um, which should have been these two. E no, them. Them, you wear those. Arms. Fuck me, which ones are the best? Those. Yes? No, that. Because that's slightly earlier. I think Ike plays as a secret agent. <laughs> I, I was like, but is, but is that a job? Of course it is, but it's a secret vocation. <laughs> it only makes sense. Um, wavering, where's the good shit here? Animistic, that's one. And I believe the silver chest plate? Uh, yeah. Yeah, that looks right. Oh, to be fair, Bitterback Island is the danger zone! <laughs> God. I'm not up to fully up to date on Archer, but I appreciate that Netflix just, like, puts out a whole season every now and then. So I basically just, every now and then, it's just like, oh, cool, I've got a whole new season of Archer to binge. That's nice. Sort of the same attitude I take with Rick and Morty at this point. It's like, I'm not actively doing it, it's just there. Binge, because that's healthy. To be fair, my intent to binge is more to avoid, like, overeating. I usually binge while playing RPGs, because then it's like, multitasking and good for the ADHD brain. <laughs> you know how it goes. Um, let's put the good skills on. I want Link Strike. I want Magic Cannon. Uh, we'll take Full Moon Slash and... No, Full Moon Slash and Magic Cannon because it's funny. I mean, they are Apex Predators. Alright, and you get... Um, all them Anodyne... Caledum, and uh, give me Holy Affinity. Hell yeah. And, oh Jesus, you need your augments. Okay. Uh, where's your good ones? I, I spend a lot on your augments. Give me the good ones. Stamina, yep. Um, greatly reduce, amplifies, cumulative... So I know knock down duration of curative's magics, reduce the damage and okay, perpetuation and beatitude. Hell yeah. Okay, good. If there is all I can do, say it. I shall aid you. Um manage stored, we're gonna put away what we don't need. Which I guess is that. Keep that. Those those those. Boop. Nice, nice, nice. Get rid of them. Get rid of them. And that. Alright. And we are going to take out some curatives. Because, uh, boy, am I going to need them. Please give me all of them. Thank you. Just, no, I just, just give me, just give me, like, all of, hang on. Give me all of them, all the potions. Just, I'll take all of them. I will take all the sauce. I wish to become goated. I bet if you made a joke, uh, went through this whole series and checked how many times I said goated with the so sauce whenever I used half spud sauce, it'd be in the triple digits. More potions that I have room for. That's why I have the increased carrying capacity. <laughs> there we go. I literally am just taking out every single potion I could ever want. Now I will never need to worry about them again. All is well. If there is all I can do, say, potions are your best friends? Ah, uh, yeah. I don't know. Okay, that's a thing. Um, I'm not going back to Consardus. Alright. What else we need? We need some pawns! Where are they? Where's the rock? Where is it? Um. Huh. Okay, I guess it's somewhere else. 
you know, I've gone through this whole game without using Throw Blast, so I don't think that's changing anytime soon. I I'll be real with ya. Uh, is there a Rift Stone around here somewhere? No. By the door? Oh. Thank you. Oh. Ooh. Well, that's interesting. On the right side by the door. Ah, there it is. Alright, let's go. Who's gonna be our friends adventuring down into the great depths? We've got a healer and we've got me, so I'll just take, like, one archer and then whoever else shows up. Rook, piss off. Alright. Who we got? V, no, you're too low level. George, low level, low level. Go away. Shoo, shoo, shoo. Zephira. Um, I don't need you. Angra, you're too high level. I don't want to be overpowered. Airbnb caves? Like, are you talking about actually living in a cave? Because that sounds kind of rad, I'm not going to lie. I'd go on a holiday and live in a cave. Oh shit, it's Waldo! <laughs> we found him. <laughs> you got skills? You've got skills. Fuck it, come along, Waldo. I am honored to travel with you. <laughs> ah, your cat is here for hugs. Yeah, I might, might be showing up at some point soon. I have got the door, like, cracked so she can come inside. If she wants to. Aegis! I'm not bringing you along. So, oh my, what have you got going on? You got good spells? Grand Ingle. You don't even have a full spell list, no. Alright, Raker. You're looking pretty suave. What do you got? High Ingle, High Frigga, High Levin, High, High, High. Yeah, why not? Yeah, come on. Nice. Let's go. Oh my. He, he, it's... <laughs> They're all just like, this is my eyedropper! Guys... <laughs> Guys, settle down. Oh, man. You can tell whenever someone's making a pawn. You can tell the difference between those who are tastefully horny, as, as is Riker here. You know, it's like, ooh, you got a nice color going on. And then, uh... Then that other one we saw, which was just Booba. Uh, hang on. Before we do this, my curiosity is getting the better of me. What's on this path? Is it another door I can't open? Probably. Yep. Sure enough. Seems to be linked to some sort of mechanism. Booba is a way of life. Uh, it is an understandable way of life. Uh, this I cannot argue. But it is. But it, it is not the only way. There, there will always. I'm gonna. I just had a thought. Oh, hello, Axel. My puppy's here. Hello, puppy. You come to join in on the stream. I'm gonna have to close the door though, because it's very noisy outside. You sure? Yeah, I thought so. Okay. I think he just wanted to say hello. Not the only way, it's the correct way. Hey, I'm d I'm just saying, there, there are other ways, as evidenced by me, who given the option, uh, chose to be femboy. So, I'm just saying. I say given the option, the law is technically that I was made to destroy the world or something, but I, I don't know. You'd have to ask my creator, and he's very dead right now. Epitaph, Crumbling red letters have been etched upon it, but they are indecipherable. Why dead? Who kill? Um, I uh, don't know. I think it was something about testing my weapon systems and the urge to kill. Uh, and I don't think he set it up properly. 
But then I just started playing video games, and then I, I suddenly found I didn't need to worry about that anymore. <laughs> Wiley, did Zero off you? Uh, something like that. I did find a copy of Mega Man. That was, that was what set it off, so... That, that may be the inspiration. We'll never know. I fucking love Beachy Galore. <laughs> Alright, uh, I guess we go in. In the door, into Bitterback. Um. Garden of Economy. Neat. This looks interesting. Let's start the dungeon crawl. Yeah. As as my computer lags to infinity, wow. Remember went to Bitter Black at level six? Oof. Oh, I am so down for this. That is exactly what I wanted right now. Oh, that's perfect. Brokeback Isle, that's my kind of Isle, alright. Let's go kill the spiders. Also, I guess level 6 here wouldn't actually be so bad. Isn't this a sort of, um... Thing where you could start doing it at level 1 and basically just have a playthrough that's just this island. That's the impression I got, that this is like its self own self-contained dungeon, if you really wanted to. It'd be difficult, but, you know, it's there. Waffle Stomp, oh my god, I hate that I know what that means. It's like a Dark Souls area of the game. Yeah. Except, um, you don't respawn when you die, so... I totally forgot to take out the extra wake stones we have. Oh well. Let me get back. Yeah, yeah, let's keep going this way. There are a few different paths to start us down, so we may as well continue. Keep going until we hit a doorway. That's what I say. Oh no, wolves! I hear they hunt in packs. Um... Is that the fucking Grim Reaper? Should I be concerned? I don't want him to see me. Um... Um... What is it? What's he doing? Ah! I'm concerned. Because he's dead. Don't make me time you out, <laughs> I'm just messing with you. Okay, no, he's a boss. Alright, fuck it. Just don't make noise, but he can't hear me. Or is he only, like, deaf in one ear? He left. Okay. He's just there to troll you, apparently. See, unlike Dark Souls, though, I know that a key to an entire half of the game is going to be hidden in some random chest. So I don't need to explore every nook and cranny. He's trying to give you a hug. Um, maybe if he had gloves on. Uh, that, that would... Oh god, snakes. Ugh. Alright, now we're going to watch out for badges. Never mind, it was just another snake. I, I mean, knowing how this game ends, there really isn't much time to live. Bop, bop, boop. St stick to the booty, son. Keep rolling, 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 rolling. Also, uh, though, to be fair, with this shield, I'm a bit more Sekiro tactics with the parries. You know? Just like, boom. Instant parry. 
Uh, alright. I guess that makes a nice big loop, which is nice. Ah, uh, there were other areas. I'll tongue your doom. Hey, this you killed the casual. You say that. Um, you can. In fact, parrying guns is a very vi In fact, a necessary mechanic. So, uh, yeah, parry this. You filthy casual, and then they cut the bullet, and you're like, oh fuck. Uh oh, that's just cause. Uh, but there's there is a serious issue. Oh man, we uh, damn. We did you play Skyrim? Uh, subtitles: Stealth Archers, the video game. Is that, a, is that not a door? Is that just a wall? That looks like a door. Okay. Well, I guess that answers that question. Every time anyone plays Skyrim, it's impossible. Now, remember, people did the math on this. No matter what, you start out playing Skyrim, right? Um, and no matter what weapon you use, whether you start out with magic or sword... Or anything else, you will eventually think, man, I'd love to be able to attack people at range without using much of a resource. Bow and arrow. Arrows are cheap and plentiful. And then you think, wow, I may as well get the first hit on them. Stealth. Not only that, but no matter what armor you wear, if even if you start out light armored and go heavy... Uh, you'll be like, man, I should level up my other armor skill. Bam, heavy armor. That's just how it is. It's just how the world works. Alright, um, so... We went this way before. Where are we now? Um, we can just continue onwards, yes. Boop, ba -da -da -ba -ba. Ba, ba, going into the dungeon of death here. We are gonna get murdered, you see. It will be death via B. It turns out the Reaper's just a B. His scythe's a stinger and he's looking at me. There's a chest up here. Oh, well, let's see. What? Merits will not be... Okay, removing curses. Gotcha. Just get the bow and stealth away. Yeah, I, I'll be real with you. You know, we were talking about nude mods earlier. If I'm being honest, um, Sky that's Skyrim's best use in 2022. I, I make no illusions that there is any other use for Skyrim these days because... Eventually, you get sick of playing the game, and you start thinking of other things to do in it. It's just the way the world works. It's like Sonic. You know, eventually people just, it stops being about the video game. Sex life, exactly. And you know what? They've done a damn good job of it. It's very impressive. The sheer amount of work that has gone into that stuff. The fuck are you? Oh, and thank you for the follow. Welcome to the visible. Hmm. Three days this one. A week, perhaps. Strengthening numbers. Guessing the lifespan of those who enter these halls. Nothing personal, mind. A rest easy, friend. Three score guesses here, and I'll be yet to hit the mark once. Yeah, I guess he was just guessing with numbers. I wonder if that's what gives him his strength. Man, it all makes sense now. Math is the true power of the universe. Someone's looking for me. Then this pit is home to stranger folk than even I'd imagine. Later, teacher. An honest mistake, most like. I've been down here half an hour. Now, will you have a look? I'll see you don't repeat. What? Wait, what are you selling? You selling healing items? Yes, I should probably buy those. Make the numbers, what a bunch of nerds. I mean, if it works, 
If it works and it's stupid, it ain't stupid. Lift stone. Oh, no, I'm good. He's selling meth. Alright, uh, excrease maximum. No, I want. Yes. Give me those. And that. Wait, got the. Yep. It's defensive. No, no. Uh, I should have that. Frozen holy water. Nostalgia dust. I feel like I want that. Uh, snap away. Kill blindness. Consumer to move more nimbly. This. The sauce! Goaded with the sauce arisen! Filtations, placative, for store health. Oh, I, that's me full on inventory space, huh? Okay, hang on. Let's, let's clear up some... Okay, so put away materials. There's that nonsense. What, what's rarify, by the way? Oh! Upgrade, okay. I mean, most of my stuff's like, uh, friggin' uh, brain fart. Dragon, Dragon Forge, so. Also, I've got some new skills to learn, I think. Magic Shield? Yes! <gasps> yes! Yes, this is exactly what I wanted. Oh, gimme, 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 gimme. Fire Enchanter. Yes! Oh, hell yeah. He upgrades your Dragonforge gear? What? Hang on, I'll go have a little look at that. I can finally enchant my own shit. Dragonforged. Oh, wow, he does, doesn't he? Damn, okay. Up to golden. Good to know. Alright, uh, yes, yeah, so I needed to make a little bit of room. So we'll quickly put away the things we don't actually need. Which, okay, it's probably some of these. Uh. Okay, you know what? I specifically got the potions, so let's not worry about these. Because they don't actually heal that much. There we go. And we can buy more potions. There we go. Perfect. What level am I? Uh, 49-ish? Okay. Cool. Um, yeah, 49. Minor 49er. Uh-oh, Raggy. Uh, let's save here. Keep on delving. Gonna be a, a long stream today, which I am game for. Claim jumper. Eh. There we go, jump the claim. I don't know what a claim jumper is. <laughs> I am unaware. I'm, I f forgive me. This looks like where we'd fight a monster. Yeah, you know, if I had to guess. What's all this then? That's another entryway, okay. Gold Rush? Uh, that stuff, yeah. I should know more about that, because there was a Gold Rush in Australia too, but... God, it's been ages since I learned about that shit. Took like... God. I did go to, um, Sovereign Hill once, which is like this big, um... Uh, essentially, like, interactive sort of museum history lesson place. It's actually a fun day out. They got, um, you know, like, you can get a horseshoe with your name on it. You can go down into actual old mines that have been, like, reinforced so they, so you can see how stuff was done. It, it was pretty cool. You even got to see, like, actual mining equipment from back in the day and, uh, see some of it used. Oh, yes, I am Australian, by the way. Uh, that's just... Yeah. If it wasn't obvious, I've been told my accent is a bit hidden. Because, uh, it's like, you know... Uh... Internet, you know? 
Grow I didn't really grow up with Australians so much as the world. It does mean I can call people a cunt, which is nice. <laughs> Oh, God. British or American? Yeah, that's what I've heard. I've actually had people around here question, um, like, am I from somewhere? Not often. It still is often, like, because Melbourne itself is very... Like, it, it doubles down because I'm in Melbourne, and that's, like, a very international city. But, um, yeah, I'm not as Australian as my uh, peers, let's say. Alright, I guess we're going in here, then. Oh, you've been to Melbourne? Nice. Yeah. Uh, for all the issues, I do lo love this city because it's so international. <laughs> oh, space Brisbane. Watch out! Space Dingo will eat your space, baby! Just like me mother. Poor Sheila. What the fuck? Oh, the zombies. Okay. Oh, wait. I can I can do a thing. Fire enchant. Yeah. I can set you on fire. Oh, fuck. What's the one line? Um. I, I gotta... I gotta look it up again. Fuck. Hang on. Um, TFS abridged J uh, Jace quotes. Hang on. It, it'll come up. I want, I gotta try and remember this. What the bleed now? We're having the right rip snorter here, and then this piker shows up, and just like that, it's good night, Irene. We get it. You're from Space Australia. That's the one. <laughs> I'm supposed to set myself on fire and climb enemies? That sounds absolutely amazing. Please tell me that's a real strategy. Because that is hilarious. Oh my god. That's perfect. I, I fucking love this game's combat. <laughs> uh, this game's combat's amazing. Imagine what the sequel will bring. Kaioken build. God. Yeah, I am actually, I've recently, oh, I say recently, God, it's probably been a few years now since I've started it. Uh, I decided I wanted to watch Dragon Ball um, in Japanese starting from episode one of Dragon Ball itself. And... Oh, what the fuck? Yeah, okay. Goddamn tentacles. Fucking mimic. Son of a bitch. Here. Wait, no, that's wrong. Oh, I want to get... Hang on, no, I want the magic cannon. Here we go, watch this. And I can shoot magic at you. Can't deal with Goku's Japanese voice? See, that's where I'm at an advantage, because growing up, I have no nostalgia for Dragon Ball. I watched episodes. I knew of it, of course. Of course I knew about it. Um, but my actual introduction to Dragon Ball was Team Four Star. So that, for me, like, that is actually their voices. But watching the original Dragon Ball in Japanese, holy shit. It's actually amazing. Like, it it holds up to this day. It's, it's an amazing, like, just watching him go from little baby G Goku uh, to beating Piccolo. It's actually just delightful. I'm getting used to Japanese voicing, yeah. Um, yeah, I, I love the Japanese voice acting. I, so I did that. Um, instead of watching Dragon Ball Z, 
and it's like 500 episodes of filler or Kai with its like weird um, soundtrack issues. I actually just rewatched Team Four Stars series and then um, then played Dragon Ball Z Kakarot, which I gotta be real with you was way more efficient use of my time. Um, <laughs> then I went on to Super that I've been watching dubbed because I can multitask and it's past the point where like censorship is really an issue you know so like the biggest thing is one voice might be a little weird or, or um they make a reference to the home for infinite losers which let's be real as far as dubisms go the home for infinite losers is amazing yeah like for real one moment Sorry, I had to cough my lungs out because I've been talking for four hours straight. Um, Abridged is actually just a really good dub. Especially, his, like, the thing is, right? Their version of Gohan's transformation is the best English version. And I don't think it's wrong to say that. I think it is entirely fair to say that they made the best English dub of Gohan's SSJ2. Because, like, just god damn, they actually dubbed the song. And I remember thinking, oh, what's this first time I watched it? I didn't realize that was in the original Japanese version. Yeah, I, I know, I'm so glad that, like, they're... As they're essentially, they're professionals now, and, like, the, their success with DBZA is recognized. And that's that's good for them. And especially, like, um... Hell, they motivated me. Um, the whole reason I'm, I'm streaming and... What? Oh, that's a big Cyclops. Neat. Um... Like, with my streaming, I know uh, one big thing I took away from them was audio. And that's why I've spent, like, in total, probably like $1,000 on audio equipment. Um, hang on. Sorry. This is what I get for not having mods. Um, uh, no, that's fine. That's not a slur. That's just shortening. <laughs> Um, but yeah, I, uh, like, that's why I've spent so much on audio equipment and why I hope, which, let me know if it's not, by the way, but I hope the audio on my stream is, like, about as good as you could hope for, you know? I, because they're the ones who taught me that the number one thing is audio quality. Many Japanese VAs kill it? Yeah. They, they do... And an outstanding job. Oh yeah, never saying dubs are bad. Just that they're... A lot of Japanese voice acting is, like, above and beyond, you know? Like, I watched, um, Dragon Ball Super Broly. Uh, in Japanese specifically. And oh my god. The voice acting on Broly and, his, and the yells that man can pull out. I actually blow me away. Um, so, hang on. We should probably go down and kill that Cyclops, huh? So they've just been exploring for a little while. Probably not a popular take, but I wish they hadn't done Super. I don't think that's as unpopular a take as you think it is. A lot of people are very split on Super. And rightfully so. I mean, so... I'm a, I'm a, I'm gonna be real with you. When I'm watching Super, I literally skipped Resurrection F and the final episode of the Future Trunks arc because I had heard what happened. So as far as I'm concerned, the Future Trunks arc just had an abrupt end with Zamasu was cut in half, and that's it. They won. That's it. No, no other info needed. <laughs> I do actually like Zamasu as a villain. I, I kind of think he's rad. But, um, yeah. Alright, let's get this going. 
that that wasn't the end? Yes, it was. I, what are you talking about? There was no episode after that. That was the last episode. And then they disappeared forever. Even after he was chopped in half to remain? No, he didn't. I, what are you talking about? There was definitely no episode after that one. It just ended right there and then, because it was... Oh. I think I lost Waldo. Whoops. <laughs> uh, surely, surely it is not a, um, a foreign concept to you um, to deliberately ignore bad pieces of media in this series. Like, I'm, I'm just deliberately choosing to ignore that because I think it's made the experience of that arc better. Just not having the ending. Or, well, sorry, having the fake ending. <laughs> Super Saiyan Rose. I, I think Super Saiyan Rose is fine. I can't see jack shit, Captain. Can't see shit, Captain. Alright. I literally can't see. Help. Thank you. Also, Trunks' future was supposed to be divorced from Goku's timeline. Yeah, there's some weird shit. Again, that's why I decided just not. Ow! Okay, mistakes were made. Uh, Alright, where's my healing? That's what I got it for. Bonk, bonk, bonk. Hopefully I can knock this dude down. I know Dragon Ball Super Heroes is a thing, but I really don't understand it. I gotta be real with you. Bonk, bonk. Oh, don't even get me started on the timeline shenanigans in the future Trunks arc. Like, I had to stop and, like, ask in the Discord so... Like, I, it took me a good 30 minutes to understand who Goku Black was and who um, Zamasu in that future was. It's so bloody confusing. And it also doesn't make a lick of sense, but that's nothing new for Dragon Ball. I'd love to knock this dude over right now. Not confusing, it's just the paradox? Yeah, I guess. Hang on, I'm a magic cannon this shit. I might do more damage. Ow! Okay, that's not gonna... Oh, please don't die. That's doing jack shit for damage, okay. Very good, get up. Ah, oh, damn it. Alright. Maybe we don't fight this dude yet. Uh, maybe maybe we head back out. Alright, this this is maybe the wrong path to go down. Let's let's use the lift stone and get out of here. We can come back down. It's not like it's very far. Oh yeah, based on the planet size Dragon Balls, there's no consequences left in the series. Yeah, that's a whole other can of worms. Alright. Hey, uh, what's up? What? There's a chest here? What's this? Large coin pouch. I'll take it. Hello. Oh yeah, I can't wait to find out that it turns out... Um, the, uh, Lord Zeno answers to the great Omni Dragon, and then that, that dragon's threatening to destroy the multiple multiverses that each of the Zenos oversees. This, see, this is why I don't get people who are mad about Kefla. Like, oh no, these transformations are so easy to acquire. Yeah, have you watched Dragon Ball in the past five years? Have you played any of the video games? That's literally what the the, the whole kit and caboodle. 
All right, let's purify this shit and see what we get. Dragon's Gaze. Uh, Rancid Bait Meat and Virtuoso Ring. Okay. Neat. That's... That's fine. Uh... I don't think I've got anything new to learn. No, not really. Uh... Demon's Wrath. Oh, my. Um... No, I'm good with this for now. Your brain is fried? That's fair. Uh, talking about anime tends to do that to people. <laughs> it's just one of those things. I mean, Bitterback is kind of just a big dungeon, so it's the perfect thing to, like, tune out and just chat about nonsense. That's why I've just sort of been wandering while we're talking about anime. Alright. Uh, well then. I guess we can jump back down. Go for another journey. What time is it, actually? Uh, four o'clock. Yeah, let's go. I got time for one more, one more trek. Let's see where we end up this time. Alright. Oh, goodness. <laughs> uh, my throat's not going to like that I streamed for four hours today, but I don't care. It's been a ton of fun. <laughs> yeah. um, the message rank, it, honestly, yeah. Like, soup is kind of a mess. <laughs> It's just a fucking mess. And like, in OG Dragon Ball, oh, it was a mess, but it was a nice mess. Super ain't so nice a mess. I oh, mean, it was interesting, because so much was, like, I didn't realize how it's, how much took from OG Dragon Ball as inspiration. Like, I, I sort of have a new appreciation for its influence on Shonen. Oh, hello! Oh, this will be fun. Uh, hang on, let me get Fire Enchanter going. You're gonna be very dead, sir. Yeah, yeah, just about like that. Come here. In the eyeball. Uh, why did I grab onto the hand? There we go. To think that used to be a serious boss fight. Ah, how far we've come. Man. I need to catch up on some anime. Isn't the new season of My Hero Academia airing soon? I I say that. I, I watched that one dubbed because the dub of that's actually very good. But that's a series I've been enjoying a lot of. Would not watch DBZ in current year? Uh, yeah, that's probably the smarter move than what I did. Season 6 is running? Nice. Yeah, I'm looking forward to the dub of that, because it's it's a good dub. Like, they do damn good work on it. I really don't know where I'm going. Uh, can I upgrade any of this? Not really. I'm gonna buy some lift stones, just so I can exit out if I need to. Uh, those tools, right? Yeah, give me some of them. However, uh, without DBZ, most modern anime would not exist as they do. Yeah, pretty much. That that sort of, that's why I watched the original Dragon Ball, because I I knew the influence it had and I wanted to appreciate that. It's the same reason I um took out a subscription for World of Warcraft for, for a short period of time. I honest to God, when I played World of Warcraft, I treated it like a museum. Like, I went and visited the Lich King and all this other shit just to be like, wow. That's where these people spent millions of hours of human life. Fascinating. And now I won't give Blizzard a single goddamn cent. Because they're other shite. Hey, what Blizzard has become? Same. Like, um... My... My... 
uh, various senpai and, and, and seniors in VTubing are all playing um, Overwatch 2. I, I make the, the honest decision that I'm sorry, but whatever may come, um, even should I join this uh, agency I'm applying for, I, pr I will make it a point not to play Blizzard games. Like, just on principle, you know? Wow, Virtual Museum visit to Leroy Jenkins Arena? I literally did. I went out of my way to seek out Leroy Jenkins. I went out of my way to fight the boss that caused corrupted blood. Like, that's the shit I did, and it was a fun time. I actually re at the time, Blizzard wasn't quite as shit, so I legitimately enjoyed my experience. But I didn't play- I didn't do any of the modern raids. Corrupted Blood, that's- Corrupted Blood's fucking legendary. That's one of the craziest things to ever happen in a video game. Like, it's insane that that happened. That's world history, dude. That shit influenced, like, our, our plans for the COVID, for COVID. Like, that, if the research done into that affected, like, real world decisions as far as, like, plague reactions, you know? It's insane. Ooh, shit. We got a butt. We got a fight. Is that a Drake? Oh, we're fighting a Drake. Hell yeah. Um, I need to, like, lighten my load a bit. I can't. Okay, I'm just gonna give that to the you, and then just deal with it. Let's fucking go! Drake fight! Let's go! Come at me, bro! I'm fine, game. Alright, hang on. Gotta get rid of these lizards. Oh, goodness. All these rapping jokes I don't get because I don't listen to popular music, to be perfectly honest. Most of my playlist is video game soundtracks. And Lady Gaga. I, I won't deny that. I, I actually have a soft spot for Lady Gaga, specifically because she hasn't had any controversies. Like, she seems to be a genuinely nice person. And that, that's like, you know what? Fuck, I gotta give it to her. Can one of you knock this dragon down? Have I heard Final Fantasy XIV soundtrack? Dude, I played Final Fantasy XIV from Heavensward to, um, to the end of Shadowbringers. I am all about that OST. That, like, Soken can do no wrong in my eyes. I stopped at the end of Shadowbringers because I thought I it felt like the perfect time to stop. If I was ever going to stop Final Fantasy XIV, that was the time I should do it. And so far, I haven't regretted my decision. I miss it, but that was a, that was like a good time in my life, and I I never regret my choices. Sixteen? Oh hell yeah! Can't wait. Like sixteen's gonna fill my like I wanna I wanna play more made by that team, so I can just play more sixteen, you know. Can always come back? I can, but it's sort of like, you know what, that's only the- my Endwalker I've heard good things about, and I probably would enjoy it, but I think that I'm happy m with my memories of Final Fantasy XIV being what they are, and I don't think I want to risk changing that, so I, I may just like- like, I go by Faris now, and that's because of fourteen. Literally, like, my name, my choice of name in real life now is because of my 14 character. And yeah, I've heard, I've heard Endwalker's a good end, and I may look up the story and, like, watch it, but I don't think I'll play again. Alright, I gotta get my pawns up, because they are fucking eating shit right now. Sixteen's battle director work at Dragon's Ogre Dark Risen. Oh fuck yeah! Don't write it off forever. Oh, I'm not. Um, hang on. I gotta like pause for a second. Uh, so the legitimate reason I stopped at Shadowbringers is that I thought 
that the job design was going downhill. And this was a common feeling among my friends in the game at the time. That the story, soundtrack, world, all outstanding. But something was going wrong with the core combat. And it just, like, the issues of every... And when they cut out, because I was a monk main. When they cut out monk Grease Lightning from Monk, I knew it was going to be a bad time if I continued. So that's why I stopped. Um, so in my memory, Monk still has Grease Lightning, and I'm keeping it that way. Um, but that's why I stopped at Endwalker when I did. So I'm not writing it off. Who knows, the game may have another resurgence given five years. As a ninja may never been a fa huge fan of Stormblood onward changes. Yeah. That, it's that sort of feeling, you know? I had a ton of fun. I cleared an ultimate. I cleared a bunch of raids. I don't think I'm going back. And I think it's for the best. Because I still, I'm still in contact with that friend group. And they, it, it, the same sentiments keep coming up. That there's, there's something wrong with the job design. Um, so yeah. That, that's sort of where I'm sitting with the whole thing. Yeah. But yeah, them cutting out Grease Lightning from Monk was that... That, for me, was the final straw. That's what pushed me into... I'm ending playing 14 with Shadowbringers. Oh, let's heal everyone up. I'm sure they'll eventually find a good middle ground, but the game I fell in love with, I don't think it's going to be the game that is there when they figure it out. And again, so that's like, again, coming back to why. Waldo, you legend! Pull him down! Oh, never mind, that works too. Ow. Lena, did you seriously die? God damn it. I need to heal everyone. Everyone's fucking dying. There we go. Also, apologies if you hear my dog barking in the background. Um, I often feel like I'm the only family member who deals with that shit, but it is what it is. Come on. Yes! In the chest. Yes! Beat him to a pulp. Hell yeah. No problem with doggo barking? That's cool. Again, that's that's one of those things where, like I was talking about, Team 4 Star and their focus on audio quality, that's like, ah, oh, there shouldn't be any background noise like that. Like, it should, uh, should, should be relatively soundproof and not stream when there's background audio, shit like that, you know? Maybe their talent is just split? That's what I think. I think 16 took a lot of their best combat designers. Which is, like, fair enough, but, yeah. Or at least, like, job combat. Oh yeah, 16's gonna be great. I don't think there's any doubt about that. Fuck! Yes! Go down! Oh! So if you killed that Drake early, you'd have a hint about the ending. Cute. Um, one big thing about Yoshi P's philosophy and why I enjoyed Final Fantasy XIV so much was he said outright, Final Fantasy XIV is not the only game you should be playing. Like, it was very blatant. This is a live service game, but listen, don't spend all your time on this. There are so many good games out there. We just hope you enjoy what we have. Don't waste your life playing this one thing. And I think that's what... That philosophy, I think even today, is still a part of Final Fantasy XIV, and I think that's what's carrying it uh, through a lot. And that's a good thing. 
that it is, yeah. All right. Mostly because I don't have time to raid. Fair. So finding time to raid. I'm, I'm legitimately. I'm shocked I managed to clear an ultimate. I, I loved my experience with it. I'm shocked I had the time for that shit. Like raiding was such a drain. Just to find the energy to keep coming back when you had to schedule it with like seven other people. It's, I'm shocked I got. I think. Yeah, I don't regret it. I think it gave me um, a lot of the confidence I needed to stream, as I do now, to keep to a, well, I don't keep to a schedule, but I keep it consistent. So at the moment, my general thing is I stream around the same time every day, and I don't have more than two days between streams. And I think I have rating to thank for that consistency. Kind of want to 100% quest from every expansion. Yeah. I made that my goal at one point. Honestly, I think I actually pulled it off. Last I recall, there were no quest markers left on my map. Oh my god, my... Ugh. If I can't talk tomorrow, I will know why. <laughs> ah, goodness. All right, so where are we going now? This is sort of a dead end, actually. I guess we go back. I guess killing the Drake was its own reward around here. Hmm, fair enough. This is about exploring, after all. Let's see what else we can find. All right. Also, I don't think that Dragon forged anything when I killed the Drake, and I know it has a chance to. Which is a bit of a shame, but eh. Goddamn snakes. Yeah. I think the other thing too is that a lot of my desire for the JRPGs is currently being filled um with single player JRPGs. Um that's why I'm playing through Xenoblade, Digital Devil Saga. That's why I started this um So okay, hang on. Uh, while, I, while I'm wondering, um, I'm a part of a server called Mystery Funhouse, and the whole thing there is we like a moonbeam gem, huh? We like to do blind races of games where you haven't played a game before and you have to reach a certain goal in it as fast as you can. So you're reacting to everything on the fly, including at times the controls of the game. Um, and so that's attracted a lot of people in that Discord who like to play new games. We're not really traditional speedrunners. Look by Void Key. Okay. We like to um, play new things. Yeah, so that's why we do blind races. So when someone finds a new game, oftentimes their first reaction is to set up a blind race for it, and everyone plays it together. Um, but yeah, in that vein, there's a lot of us who like new stuff. Um, is this another Moonbeam Gem? Moonbeam Gem. Okay, I'm getting a feel for this now. Um, so in that vein, I proposed in there a JRPG book club. So every month, we pick a JRPG, um, voted on, everyone gets to suggest one, and we vote on our favorites. And, um, the, and then we all play through it and talk about it with each other, because oftentimes a lot of the fun of a JRPG can be talking with friends about the story beats and things that are happening. So, um, yeah, that's gotten started in there, and that's that's been a lot of fun, and that sort of scratched my MMO itch. So we started with Dragon Quest III, um, then we did Romancing Saga, and now we're doing Shin Megami Tensei Digital Devil Saga. And um, anyone's welcome to join in, because all it is is just come play a game. JRPGs aren't so good for racing, so this is a way we can all play new JRPGs together. Romancing Saga, no, the original. Um, a part of it is to gain a bigger appreciation for the genre. Hmm. Might be able to restore it. Yeah, sure. Um, yeah, so we played the original to, like, have an appreciation. And there are people in there who've played, like, sequel, um, sequels to Romancing Saga 
or um, they played the saga games on Final, the Final Fantasy Legends. So to play Romancing Saga gave them a lot of appreciation, you know? Unlimited, yes, there are people there who'd played Saga Frontier and Unlimited or the remake. So those people then, like, had an excuse to play the original and have an appreciation for that. So, yeah, that's, um, yeah, and this month's is Digital Devil Saga, so we've been playing that. Let us continue our exploration using this stone as a hub. Also, something, um, you touched on is that you, um, don't think you'd be ever be able to speedrun. I'm the same way. I could never sit down and practice a game like, like top tier speedrunners could. That's why I came to do blind racing. Because you don't need to practice. Your practice is just playing as many video games as you can. And um, it, it still has skill. It still requires skill and, and focus. And it's not random who wins. Um, you, you will see. There is a definite skill you can learn to play these games. Um, I'm going backwards. But it let you do it without having to sit down and practice a game. You don't like rushing? Okay, that would be a bigger issue, fair. <laughs> but yeah, like, I joined in having, like, I don't speedrun. Um, I made top 8 on my first tournament, and not to brag, but I am currently the reigning champion. Uh, we get like 100 people in these tournaments. Um, and our finals get streamed on GDQ too, because um, obviously we're still connected with, like, random speedrunning. So, um, yeah, and, it, yeah, um, current champion, so I, I don't, I try not to bring it up too much, but there's something to be said about the skill needed there. Why do champions reign? Um, it's, it's actually a leak. It's oil leaking out from some of the joints, you know, like in my arm, you know, that, that's why it's raining. It's actually raining oil. That's what they mean by champions reign. Uh, what am I on about? Is that the droid joke? Yes. Welcome to the stream. There will be many robot jokes. In fact, fun fact, um, gas behind the scenes VTuber uh, thing. I am actually, I chose a droid as my VTuber specifically because people said my gameplay was robotic. It was so good. Like it, they were saying like, why does it look like he's, he's cheating? It's like a robot's playing. And uh, I've, I've had that happen to me so many times in my life that now I'm, I'm embracing it. Robotnik? Yeah. Yeah, just people would just say, like, dude, you're playing like a goddamn robot. How are you doing that? So I've embraced it, and now I am, a, I am literally a robot gamer. So if, you, if you're wondering where the inspiration for that was, uh, there you go. Damn, Eggman, yeah. <laughs> Eggman making the gaming bots. It's just the Eggman from the uh, Snapcube uh, live live dubs. I'm a gamer. Remind me of Cast on PS2 2. That was one of my inspirations. Ah, I'm so glad that that's the thing. <laughs> Direct inspiration for this model, which again I'm I'm happy to share this stuff. Um, was Cast was Mega Man. Like Zero, specifically Me X style Mega Man. And um, a very big inspiration was Kibo from Danganronpa V3. Um, just because he was big on the mind, and you know what? He's a cute robo boy too. So I'm, I'm, gl I'm glad you called on for the cast, because yeah, that when I was commissioning this model, that was one of the references I gave. That's, that's cool. Alright, where am I going? I don't really know. I'm just wondering. Boop. I'll take that. Where am I now? Um, I'm heading back down into... Under the sea. <laughs> not quite, not quite. Listen, I'd love to visit Atlantis. That's a great movie. And MTV series. That is a Disney and Stargate joke for you. Alright. 
I guess we don't have to fight this dude, but I really want to fight this dude. So I'm going to save and try and fight this dude again. Let's see what happens. It'll be funny. Oh shit, I'm over encumbered. Hang on. Uh, let me give some things to my pawn. That. Oh, hang on. Give. Max. There we go. Alright, I gotta... Fuck me. Hang on. There we go. Give those. That and that and one of them. Dark anti-suicide. Talk about a mood killer of an ad. I, I wish I could turn them off fully, but sadly no. Um, that's, I've heard some people are actually switching off of Twitch because of that, which I don't know if I ever will, but, um, I guess it is a thing. Um, is this actually better? No. Okay. Here. All right. That's, that's low enough. Let's go. Fight! 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 Suicide is a huge- I- I actually do know that. I do know that's- that- that is like a real thing. It's- it's pretty sad actually, but... Again, that's like Twitch. That's kind of a bad moment to bring that up. I mean, I'm all for support, like, being open about mental health, but like... In an ad? That's like just a mood killer, you know? I have this distinct feeling we are going to eat shit and die. Uh, okay. Yep. Hmm. Yeah, I probably shouldn't have fought this dude, huh? Yeah, okay. So we're not gonna fight this dude. <laughs> That's just a bad time. I mean, I've, I've gone through my own mental health issues, it's... God, I feel like the world's just, like, not doing... There's a lot in the world that doesn't do a good job to help people with it, and... It sucks, you know? Um... Yeah. Especially in America, where, like, it's not even... It's... Apparently it's, like, the insurance and not having public health care. I don't know how you guys could hand, handle that shit. Which, I guess to be fair, several, there are, there's a huge percentage of you who don't handle that shit. That's, um, why certain votes go the way they do, but that's a whole other can of worms. Um, I can, yeah, I can jump down here. What's all this? Ugh. Poison blood. Okay, that's not so nice. I mean, I guess walking through blood would be pretty poisonous. Just imagine fighting a Gundam. Yeah, basically. Oh, I should get a Gundam form for myself. That'd be fun. I just like turn into a giant, a giant robot and take over. <laughs> you just see, I will, you don't even have to draw a leg. You could just draw like a Gundam leg and call it my Gundam form. <laughs> oh shit! I want to do that now. That sounds like fun. What the fuck? Oh, it's just the music being weird. Okay. Um, can I like... I don't think... No, I'm, I'm just seeing things here, I think. No, I'm not. There's something down there. Japan working overtime to produce Big Mechs. Mm-hmm. Big Mechs that actually walk around and like can be dr driven. Like, the, the, people say a bipedal mech is impractical. That's only if it's not trying to directly mimic the human body. If it is, then it can only be bipedal. That's the whole logic. That's why a lot of uh, giant mech stories now do, like, the psychic link stuff. Because that's when you need a bipedal robot. People can, can't, like, adapt to uh, treads so well. I mean, some people could, but... And he mentioned that. Oh, 
Is, is there a giant robot? Ever heard of the anime Knights of Magic? Can't say I have. Um, that one has not come across my radar. Actually, for that matter, I haven't watched many giant robot anime. I watched Macro- Oh god! Uh-oh. Oh! Ari the Arisen fell over and ate shit. God damn. Magitek Isekai? Ah, oh, yeah. See, that's actually- I'll be honest, that's actually why I can't watch many mecha shows. Um, I hate it when it's like, Welcome to this giant robot person who has never been trained or is not at all qualified. It's like, dude, that shit takes practice. That's why I like Knights of Sidonia. There was a genuine explanation for why the dude was so good at um, driving a robot. But, um, yeah. Actually, for that matter, I haven't watched much Isekai. And the first Pacific Rim. Oh, hell yeah. Like, listen. I love Pacific Rim. Like, that movie's a fucking, like... But, but now, these days, I think it's lost its spot because Godzilla vs. Kong exists. Like, that movie did what Pacific Rim was trying to do, but better. But I, I appreciate it for what it was. Speaking of good music, oh, fuck yeah, the Pacific Rim soundtrack. Absolute banger. Did you mention Xenoblade Chronicles? Yes! I'm in the middle of three, and I've beaten one and two, and I fucking love those games. The best. They're both amazing. The soundtrack is amazing. Xenoblade 2. Composer? Yeah, yes? Hiroyuki Suwano? Uh, yep. I'm following. If I'm meant to recognize that name, I don't. I like him just as much as Soken. Fair! Yeah, that does very fair. Need a remake of Xenogears? God, I wish. But I don't think Square Enix is going to play nice. Oh, it does Attack on Titan. Okay. Soken on the helm. Yeah. I haven't watched Seven Deadly since. That, that, again, didn't cross my radar. Void Key! Oh, shit! We found it. Alright, um, I gotta, I really gotta clear out my inventory. Jesus. There we go. That'll do. God damn it. Yes, he is. Please don't break him free. Uh, can we not enter hell? I'm not a robot powered by blood. That That's V2. I Listen, one of the few things I do know about myself is I am not powered by blood. I'm powered by soda. Speaking of, take a drink. <laughs> Aldo Noah Zero, you know, I watched one episode of Aldo Noah Zero. The music, I don't remember much. I'm sure it's great. I fucking hated that show. The first episode was utter shit. It was the most boring thing I'd ever watched. I, I, I'm sorry, but that that's just the fact. Me and a friend were like, yeah, let's watch it. We've heard good things. And like, oh my god. I don't give a single shit about anyone here. I don't want to watch another episode. And then we didn't. Alright, it's a void key. Void key. Is that working here? Is this the void? I don't think this was the void key. Nope. It was a made for TV. Iron-Blooded Orphans. I've heard that name a lot. I feel like I should know it, but I don't. 
as in no source material. Ah, yeah. Actually, that's part of why we watched it. But, um, yeah, then we just got extremely, extremely bored. A Gundam? Okay. Maybe I should... I, I do put together a lot of Gunpla. I love putting together the model kits. But, um, not watch much Gundam. Actually, I've watched no Gundam at all. I literally just buy them based on what looks cool. I just buy cool looking Gundam and that that's it. Um, the key. That was over here. Yeah. Barbados Gundam? See, you say that, and I'm like, I should know which one Barbados is, but I genuinely don't. I get, I, like, I'm not even, like, up to date on the popular kits. I literally go to my local hobby shop and pick them off the shelf. That's how I pick my favorite, my next Gunpla kit. Unicorn Gundam. I've heard I should watch Unicorn Gundam. That, that is something I've heard. Um, maybe, honestly... Is the dub for it any good? If the dub's for it's good, I might watch it after dra I finish Dragon Ball Super. Because then I can multitask, you know? Man, these dead bodies really don't shut up, do they? Solo leveling is getting an anime. This looks interesting. It's been, I... My, I'll be honest, with that title, my mind immediately goes to, to making a joke, like, Solo leveling is getting an anime. Wow, I can't believe Insert JRPG here is getting an anime. Yeah, some, something along those lines. Solo leveling. Wow, I can't believe Shin Megami Tensei is getting an anime. It's a Korean comic? Okay. The hell? But yeah, no, actually, though, is the Unicorn Gundam dub good? Where the other world comes to you? Oh, like the devil gets a part-time job? I love that show. Even if it sort of ended anticlimactically. Not much of a mecha person? Fair. And Berserk has news of continuing, yeah. Um, I did read about that, that, um, they're going to finish the story as they are aware it wanted to be, the, it, the creator wanted it to be finished. Which I think is perfectly fair. And, honestly, if they have that knowledge, like, it should be finished so everyone can experience that and appreciate it more, you know? I, I've only ever, I've got, um, one volume of Berserk. Uh, I want to get more. I it's one I specifically like because the artwork. Oh my god, that's one. That's a manga I picked out specifically because the art is fucking phenomenal. It's absolute. Every page is just fucking gorgeous. Like that's why I specifically want to keep reading the manga just just for that artwork. Like it's it's just beautiful. Hey, it's Cockatrice. If I ever fought one of them cocks, I'd laugh at how silly it was. I'm beyond impatient so you read manga novels. Fair. I am actually extremely patient, and that's the only reason I have not um, read ahead in JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. Um, the... Fuck, what's the animation studio for JoJo? Well, anyway, they've done such a good job so far, I trust them to adapt the manga faithfully. Um, I should not get petrified? That would be a very bad way for this to end. Um... Shit, I do have a petrified cure, right? I don't know a petrified cure. Here we go. Yeah, but once you catch up to the latest one, then you get to be that person who is fully up to date. Which has its own perks. You know, absolutely 100% spoiler free. I 
I should probably cast Fire Enchanter, huh? Don't care about spoilers? Fair. Honestly, um, that's lucky. Like, good, good for you. I can't imagine not. I am a. I care probably more than I should about spoilers. Or read the light novel once you catch up to the manga. God. And then you go play the visual novel. <laughs> There you go, mate. Oi. Don't, don't you fly away. Don't you dare fly away. Read the night level before it gets a MAGA. Damn. That's kind of impressive, to be honest. Yeah, I, I tend to just, like, avoid spoilers and wait for the anime. Berserk is literally the only manga I specifically sought out because, well, the manga is literally better than any Berserk anime. By a long shot. You cancelled my spells, you bastard. Um, we're down the pawn. Alright. I think someone got petrified. There we go. Got your tail. Alright, let's get off. Oh, yeah, that's fair. I, I just... I think that a lot of anime do, like... You know, especially the ones that, like, take the manga as essentially a storyboard. It's like, well, at that point, it's just, like, only making the, the intent even clearer. Especially if it's done well. Like, if it's done poorly, that's a whole other can of worms. Bonk, bonk, bonk! Die! It's a die. There we go. Alright. Come here, you. Strength in numbers arisen. Strength in numbers arisen. Strength in numbers arisen. Strength in numbers arisen. Strength in numbers. Strength in numbers to you too. Strength in numbers arisen. Strength in numbers arisen. And so on and so forth. Ah, oh dear. Just as much about the journey as much as getting there. Yeah, that's fair. Dude MT. What? Mystery tournament? Is it WN? I'm not sure I follow. <laughs> oh, fuck. It's a boulder! Waldo, look out! He's fine. Mushoku Tensei. Okay. I haven't heard of that one. I think y'all are more anime than I am. And I say that as the VTuber. <laughs> Oh, what the hell is that? Alright, who's gonna- who's- who's talking shit? I hear someone talking shit around this corner. Oh, it's you. There, Master. Ogres. Alright. Oh, they're having a conversation. Let's interrupt it. It'll be funny. Alright, 
I'm gonna need you to die real quick. Hang on. Let me um fire and chat. But you son of a bitch. Don't pick me up and take me away. Goddamn ogre. Thank you. I'm pretty sure you just threw firecrackers at the ogre, mate. And it's dead. Oh, that was easy. Alrighty. And what's through here? Oh shit, the door actually opened. I was not ready for that. Um, hang on. I have no clue what turning point three is. <laughs> uh, you guys are like, you've gone beyond what my own anime experience. I'll be, uh, I'll be real with you. What the, f what the hell? Where am I? Vault of Defiled Truth, second floor. Okay. Uh, isn't this like the copy of the garden? Oh, I guess the entrance is sealed off, so no. Alright, whatever. Let's go down here. What's the worst that could happen? Uh, alright. Got more goblins. Okay. You got goblin the goblins. Gobble, gobble, gobble. Gobble, gobble, gobble! Wait, they can use magic now? They can fly now? Oh, God. Okay. Did someone say goblins? 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 Chocolate? I mean, goblins? They're only good. Oh, God. God damn Goblin Slayer. That's a whole other can of worms. I'm gonna talk anime to, that, uh... I mean... <laughs> there, there are words I could say about Goblin Slayer, except I'm pretty sure if I say them I'll get banned from Twitch. <laughs> so maybe I shouldn't say them. Just know that I have thoughts on Goblin Slayer that are uh, essentially nothing at all to do with Goblin Slayer, but just a certain genre. Yeah, let's go with that. Let's go with the word genre. And um, then we won't say any more because I'd like to keep streaming on Twitch. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, Vor? Oh, no, not Vor. You know what? I, I, I will say that. No, um, th not that. <laughs> I didn't even know that was a thing in the series. I mean, I knew they ate people, but I, I that like that part didn't really cross my mind. You see, I'll, I'll be honest. I haven't watched Goblin Slayer. I wouldn't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, see, see, yeah, that like that's a thing that is in Goblin Slayer, and my opinion of it ha has essentially zero to do with Goblin Slayer itself. So, I, I that, that's sort of where I'll, I'll end this train of thought for now. Uh, you just know that I'm a fucking weirdo and move on. Um, where am I going? So I've done that. Is there a, this is the first floor. I guess we can just go north? Yeah, let's go north. We're all degenerates. I mean, we are sitting here talking about anime. Like, what else do we expect, you know? Uh, talking about anime while playing, like, a ten-year-old video game. Did you just go for a swim? Well, don't get eaten by the brine. Better, <laughs> better. 
If I watch a new anime, watch MT in Japanese. I, I think there's a lot of things before I get to that, but I'll keep that in mind. If I see it pop up somewhere, like uh, while I'm browsing for stuff to watch, I, I shall rec I shall remember. I shall remember the letters. The snow MC is garbage. Oh, why? Why did you just say? Um. By the way, it's an anime. Like I don't. I'm not. What the fuck? Oh. Hello. Please don't tell me that's a big hellhound. Oh fuck me, that's a big hellhound, isn't it? All right. I guess this is happening now. This is gonna suck, okay. Hey, pawns, if you could get down here, that'd be lovely. Oh, they Fire Enchant, he just attacked me. God damn it. I'm fucking dead, aren't I? Get off. Okay. I, here they are, okay. Ah, uh, this is turning into a bad time very fast. Oh shit. Um, we might be in trouble. Alright, I need to get fire now. There we go. Damn it. Let me meet Garm. Garm, eat your lunch. Yep. Uh, hi, Garm. Oh, God. Garm, I can't even get a hit on you. Oh, God. Um, fuck this. You know what? I don't want to die yet. I'm going to wait till I get better gear. Fuck the bye. I'm out. Peace. We don't need to kill everything here. Doc's Elden Ring taught me that one. Okay. Now we know about Demon Puppy. What's that? Have we sufficient stores of oil? <sighs> Alright. Jumping down a ledge. Judge well the distance. Judge well the distance? I don't think that's the deadliest thing here. What's this? Warriors Respite. Oh, that sounds nice. Oh, we can get a new pawn. Please. Alright. So we got that. We got a chest. Sobering wine. This healing juice. Healing juice. Had I an empty flask? Okay. Okay. What's what's down here? Before I make any other decisions. Hello. What are you doing here? When I was made a wizard, I asked myself just what sort of role it was the world had handed me. From the very start, I had no interest in chasing after my heart. Useless. If eternity was mine. As I saw fit, I'd pass it doing what I liked. That was my answer. And what have you? You the type to buy into talk of duty and fate and all that? <laughs> I've stopped thinking about it, truth be told. Like as not, there is no real answer. Empty, okay. Okay, I'll keep MT the anime in mind. Thank, thank you for tuning in, Rango. It's nice having you. I'm probably not going to go too much longer myself. Actually, what time is it? You know what? It's five o'clock. I should stop. So you know what? We've just hit a rest point. Um, this is probably a good time to stop anyway. Um, and with that said, oh hello. So I'll take those. 
Fascinating. We've got a lift stone if we want to leave, a bed if we want to rest. And... Some more shit down here, apparently. Ooh, and a chest! With a bit of back novelty. 2pm. <laughs> Time zones! What a hoot. Alright. Yeah, I think this is a good point to stop things for now. Unless we find another secret. Mm, oh. Moonbeam gem! Hey! Yeah, sure enough. Okay. Alright, let's save here. And I thank you all for tuning in. It was it was quite the stream today, but it was a good one. Um, thank you again to Ike for that raid. That that was a that was a boost and a half. <laughs> Appreciate it. And speaking of raiding and giving people a boost, why don't we see who else is streaming, eh? Who can I send y'all off to? Alright, anyone else playing Dragon's Dogma? It would only be fair. Dragon's Dogma Dark Arisen. Who else is streaming here? We've got someone with a lot of views, but let's go with the someone who has not got so many views. Because that is, that is the way. Is it not? Yeah. You know what? Y'all can go to... Let me get this person up here. Uh, actually... Man, that one's a bit streamy. Don't mind the audio, I gotta remember to mute Twitch. Okay. Go for it, this person just start now, give him a boost. Go have fun. And, uh, hopefully, we'll see y'all next time for, well, a bit more Dragon's Dogma, because we got this isle to finish. Take care.